What is going on, y'all? And welcome back to the stream. Welcome back to Offered Outlaws. And I am extremely pumped to kick the stream off today. Now, obviously, with it being a Wednesday, we're starting a little bit later on in the day at about 4 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. But these later on streams are always fun because they're always really like they're they're, they're chill, they're relaxed, but they're also like honestly, I feel like we get to spend a lot more like you know we get to spend a lot more time just chilling out with you guys out there in the chat. We get to spend time building some really sick trucks, and I of course get to take a bunch of awesome suggestions from you guys in the chat and in the Discord as well. And also, we will have a Discord truck meet running for the entirety of the stream. So please do keep that in mind. And if you want to take part in that, make sure, make sure that you use the link that is about to be pinned out there in the chat. It's not pinned out there quite yet, but make sure that you guys are ready when that link is out there. I am super excited to jump into it today, guys. It is going to be a blast of a stream. I hope you guys are having a wonderful week week so far, by the way. I'm saying, uh, let's see, I, we got Banana out there in the chat, we got Yeetboy33, we got Skull Gaming on Diesel Burners Garage, we got Ruth Ward, we got Gaming with, uh, Xander OMG, what's got, uh, what's good, bud, just got home from school, like, yeah, we got Malik Gardner, we got, uh, Enoch Jacobs, and let's see, uh, Hagen, what's up? I see you out there in the chat, thank you so much for stopping by, but let's see, uh, Ray J is apparently very angry, Ray J is ragey, um, let's see, we got Bob, we got Bubba 12B, we got DBL Gaming, and we got, let's see, Tyler, TM K Gaiman and Steven and Rocky and Blake and Crispy Bacon. What's up, dude? Skull Gaiman and Ned. Let's see. Uh, we got Soy out there in the chat. We got uh, Walk Cider and let's see. Ye CC1. <laughs> All of the ye. If you guys want to check out the Discord server, make sure that you hit that pinned link. And also, that is how you can partake in our virtual truck meet. And we, of course, have many upcoming open lobby rounds in the stream as well. We got Armstrong, we got Trent, we got Oz, we got Mr. Stout and Hanketh. And let's see, is that really what the name is? Yep, I think that's how you pronounce it, I think. Uh, let's see, Logan the Redneck. We also got General Pop and Lock. And let's see, uh, Alex Pons and Clark Boy. And also, let's see, Alex, what's up, dude? And let's see. Ray J says, oh, some problems with my internet. I get you, dude. I get you 100%. Yeah. Internet issues can always be very, very, very uh, frustrating, to say the least. Uh, let's see. VR Jax and Dripmaster and Offroad King and Corrupt Glitch Hero Brian. What's up, dude? Uh, where's Diesel? Well, he may be. Uh, he may be. Uh, let's see. It's Hank. Yeah, that's what I thought. Um, let's see. How do you do meets? Um, well, we're going to be doing um, some meets in the game itself by allowing you guys to jump into the games with me. But, of course, those are on a. Uh, those are in, like, different random lobbies. And also. Boo. What's up, bud? I see out there in the chat. I'm actually about to drop into the VC so we can uh, we can hit that up as well. But it's gonna be it's gonna be quite an interesting one today, I think. Now, obviously, a little bit of big TC action, but we're right back into the game itself. Diesel is always in with the boo. But yeah, let's see how many trucks do you have in total. Right now, we have over a hundred trucks. And let's see. Jason says, "Oh, goodbye, goodbye. Why?" Mm. You just got here. But at the same time, I mean, hey, you know, you can come and go as you please. That is the beauty of a uh, stream. So let's see. Uh, BC Customs once again. What's up? I see you saying hi out there in the chat. We got, um... We got the Flying J checking in, and let's see, uh, Rebecca Pamperl, what's up? Man, I have sword. He scared me, right? No, he's very good at that. Um, now, I don't know. Oh, Ghost Racing and Tyson Miller, what's up, you guys? Now, again, Diesel is sneaky like that. He's always been sneaky like that, and, you know, he may or may not show up in the stream like that as well. Um... Because, I mean, really, at coffee? Oh, this is actually, this is a massive smoothie. Like, this is not my norm uh, for a stream. But, dude, um, let's see. He probably just, wait. Huh? He probably left because you had a purple truck, LOL. Nah. He's, you know what the purple truck is going to make him do? It's just going to make him show up with something even crazier. Now, obviously, with this truck having a heavy focus in the previous stream, when we did the custom light bars in the front, we did the, like, the chrome grill, we did the logos, all that good stuff. I think what we're going to do to kick this off is we're actually going to take where it says 2500 HD, and we're going to actually upgrade it to a... 3500 HD, and we're gonna add, um, whoa, okay, that kind of, that just turned it into an arrow, I don't know why it did that, um, uh, that's kind of weird, 
Okay, well, I'll just create another uh, 2,500 HD or 3,500 HD over there. That's weird. Why would it have turned it into a freaking, like, backwards arrow? That's very strange. Let's see. You need a voice changer for Halloween. That would be hilarious. Absolutely. What's up, Juju's channel? Let's see you out there in the chat. We also got Yeeboy33 and Christopher Landon checking in. Thank you guys once again so much for stopping by with us today. We are currently getting this thing ready to convert it into an even larger setup. We're going to turn it into a dually. It's going to go up to a basically an even higher plane than it was on the previous stream. So let's see. TC, you just have to hit the text again. Do you really? What even makes it do that? Like, what is the reason behind the, like, behind the game doing that? Like, I've never been able to figure that out. And if anybody knows out there in the chat, it would be amazing to be able to finally have a, like, an answer to why the game does that. Let's see. Uh, Brianna and Travis and Truck and Giras, what's up? Cheese, cheese taste good. Well then, uh, let's see. Um, Oh my god, Corrupt Glitch Hero Bride, bruh, because of our outlaws, I guess, yeah, let's see, Riker Weiler, what's up, dude, any update news, well, we're waiting for more of that to come in as we speak, but we will absolutely let you know when that is in the, uh, when that is coming into the works, so let's actually check in on the Offered Outlaws channel in the Discord server, and we've actually got some S10s already posting up in there in the stream, it's actually an... Let's see. Oh, that's interesting. A it was a custom uh 93 Chevy Highlander and it was a replica of that truck. That's pretty wild. Dude, whoa. Okay, someone just dropped. Let's see, a couple of my newest builds. I've seen a very stanced Bronco. I think I've seen a couple of those builds before, but um, that blue Chevy certainly looks new. If you guys want to participate in the Discord truck meet, make sure you use the link that is pinned up at the top of the chat and head on over to the Discord server and jump into the Offered Outlaws channel. What's up? Let's see, Anthony Carter and, uh, let's see, Caden Backdraft, what's up? And let's see, what's the, what's the gist with my ban? I've learned my lesson. We're still figuring that out. We're still figuring that out. Let's see, I made a drag bug that goes 213 miles an hour. Good grief. That is gnarly. Yeah, we're definitely going to have to put that to the test. Let me add some... Yes, there we go. Now, really, the only thing we have to do is add the dually fenders, and it should be solid. I mean, along, as long as the game doesn't crash. So I see we're building campers. Well, you totally have the option to. I mean, I have my camper as well, and I'm not sure when and where we're going to use it, but we definitely are. I want to join the truck meet thing, but I'm banned. I mean, again, we're still sorting that out, but we will get that info to you uh, as soon as we figure out why you were banned in the first place. So let's see. Show us the three-wheeler. Oh, don't worry. The three-wheeler is definitely going to be something that we can use. So this guy right here was a bit of a... It was kind of a build that I did sort of on a whim, so to speak. I just kind of did it out of nowhere. And let's see, Skullgaming, I have requested a video. Can you play Brick Rigs? Um, Brick Rigs, I can't talk for some reason. Brick Rigs is a game that I have not played in a very, very long time. It's a very interesting game, though. And I think that it's, like, it's right up there in terms of, like, when I say interesting games, it's right up there with games like, um, like Teardown. Teardown looks super interesting, too. Now, do you guys think this looks better as a dually, better as a 3500, or do you think we should go back to the 2500 kind of mindset let me know in that comment section and also I think we might change up the color I think the color can um I think it's it's really good right now obviously I really like the whole purple aspect of it but I think if we changed it up to something a little bit different I think we could really bring like a whole new side of this truck to life so Let's see if we can do kind of like a lot of people were suggesting like a glossy light blue um, back in the uh, in the previous stream. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to see if we can match that with the suspension and make it look somewhat somewhat usable, somewhat good. So let's go ahead and apply that. And I don't know. I mean, I'm back and forth about it. What do you guys think about running the truck like this? Like, I think it turned out well, but let's see. I'm back in, I'm tempted to join your service, but why is it purple? Hey, I mean, to be honest, like, it started out as purple on the last stream, but this truck is an ever-evolving project. You're going to show us the three-wheeler, yay? Oh, dude, absolutely. That's small, TC. Wait, what? Make it gray-blue. Gray-blue? Uh, what do you mean? So, you mean, like, gray on the truck and blue on the suspension? That could totally, totally be actually a really doable thing. Um, oh, I'm loving in the Discord server, someone has a combination of Fox uh, suspension livery Raptors. That looks really good. Also, I love how the dude with the second gen, like, literally blurred out everything else. Uh, like, literally besides the truck. Very nice Nova. 
Um, that green Nova Carboy, that's looking really, really good. Wrecker the Striker with the uh, five ton. The Forerunner from Diesel Burner's Garage. That's awesome. And let's see, we got a custom camper. We got an F-350. We've got, like, actually a really nice lineup of rigs in the Discord server. That's awesome. Now, let's see. Um, I don't know why it turns to a text arrow, but I'm used to it because I make trucks all the time. I get that. Yeah, I get that. Shadow Assassin, what's up? Uh, what game do you, um, wait, oh, make it white? I wonder how that would look, like a glossy white. Let's see, like a glossy white, but with... The blue accents on the suspension. That's actually got a nice look to it. Especially with our um, custom license plate and all that good stuff on the back. That looks really, 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 really good. And Mr. Gamer, I do indeed remember you. Welcome back. Wait. Huh? Someone's... The, literally the dude that said, make it white. And I made it white. And then he goes, it's ugly. And I'm like, what? How do you... Oh, that's neat. Look at that. Oh, what? Yo, look at the freaking, like, taillights as the eyes of the skulls. That looks amazing. Yo, that is so good. All right, so we're going to put the Yeep in the trailer. And the reason why we're putting the Yeep in the trailer slash camper is because we're actually going to be... Wait, he says, it's meh. And I'm like, bruh, I've got something that'll look good uh, next to that GMC. 95% gray, 5% blue matte. Whoa, that would be, that would be an interesting one. Hold on, uh, let's see, Matt, and then let's see, wait, uh, hold on. All right, 95% gray, and then 5% blue, so like a, like a muted, like, hyper dark blue. That actually... You know what, though? The reflective stickers look amazing with that. We would just need to change up the accent color. You know what I mean? Um, wait, let's see. So the car has some skull... Really? Bruh. Bruh. Come on. Come on, dude. What's up, Rose R7? I see you out there in the chat. TMK Gaming, you literally just join up into the server and you throw a photo of your truck into the Offered Outlaws channel in our Discord server itself. So now, it's actually time to... Ooh, I love how it's got, like, some ghost lettering going on. This actually looks really, really, really good. See what I mean? It's nice. It is. It's just... I don't know if it's what I want to stick with. You know? I think that this truck needs something that's a little bit more... Um, like, a little bit brighter, a little bit more intense. And actually, I'm getting kind of close to back to where I had the truck before. And I like it in this kind of tone and in this kind of setup, but I may just black out the wheels real quick, and then once I once I black out the wheels or maybe kind of make them a chrome gray, I think that'll really set off the look that I'm looking for. So we'll darken the chrome a little bit, and let's see, let's get it a little bit darker. That looks that looks nasty, actually. That looks nasty, dude. Okay, now I'm starting to. Now I'm starting to like where this is going. Now I'm absolutely starting to like where this is going. I have an RC drift truck with red underglow. That's awesome. How'd you make those stickers shiny? I mean, there's actually, I believe, a finish option, um, like, in the vinyl editor where you can make them, um, you can make them shiny. And actually, before we continue on, I'm going to take this one and make it 3D. So I'm going to duplicate it. And then now that I've duplicated it, I'm also going to uh, to make it 3D by doing a custom layer um, on top of it. Now, here, actually, we'll make it, we'll black it out, and that'll look a little bit better. And because of the one underneath it, it effectively makes the logo itself 3D. So we'll duplicate this one as well. We'll darken the color of it. And then we will make it 3D. And now that we have the 3D text, it hits a lot harder. It really punches in with that look. And it, it's almost like it's jumping out of the side of the truck. Rest of Ranch, Four Wheels and Gaming, and DT uh, Taylor H20. What's up? The symbol looks like a sun. Yeah, that one. Like, the one that looks like a really bright sun. Literally that one. Also, I just realized I never put a gas door on this truck. And someone out there in the chat knows, are Chevy gas doors... Are they square or are they circular? Mega Bike Kids, what's up, dude? ADV Rider and Nathan Cross, welcome back. Make suspension like the wheels. Oh, I gotcha, I gotcha. So you're saying like darken, um, 
like darken the wheels a little bit. That's not realistic. How is it not realistic? Let's see. Uh, Samantha Griffin and Yeet Boy 33. What's up, you guys? Circle, circle, Lolly D. What's up, dude? Wait a minute. I'm getting conflicting answers. Is it circular? Okay. I figured it was circular, but I just wasn't sure. I was just like, uh, are we like, are we positive here? Um, let's see. So we'll put you kind of right about here, not too far down. Obviously, we don't want it to conflict with the dual defender. And let's see, there's circles on my GMC. Gotcha, 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 gotcha. Get well, oh, okay. Fuel cap. Sorry. Fuel cap. Because diesel. Um, a fuel door seems kind of necessary. I mean, that's fair, because if you didn't have one, then you know, where would you actually fill it up at? But I'm pretty sure that we've got it on the right side. We've just got to figure it out. And let's see, uh, Rope Leclerc, what's up, dude? Uh, I did not know that you could mix colors. Yeah, yeah, you could you could fade them into each other and all that good stuff. Make it small, or it's smaller than that. That's true. However, you kind of have to make things a little bit more exaggerated in Offered Outlaws uh, when you're designing stuff. Otherwise, they'll sort of get like muted out. Essentially, like they they're harder to see because of the level that the game renders things at. Let's see, are you making a Thanos truck or the Purple Gun truck from uh, Five Nights at Freddy's? Oh my God, no. I, did you make a video building this truck? This truck was an entire, like, stream build. So, we used a bunch of different elements from the stream. Oh, God, I have my Seaboys TV truck right here. But it didn't really... It didn't turn out the way I wanted it to turn out. And we may or may not revisit it a little bit later. But we've got a couple of other projects that we definitely need to touch on real quick. And love the stream and love the truck. Thank you so much, Matthew Country. Welcome back, dude. Thank you so much for stopping by. We're going to be dropping into the Discord server um, periodically throughout the stream to check out the builds that you guys have been doing and also rate them as I, um, like, as I see them coming through. So let's actually get this Bronco back out of the garage because we have a couple of things that we got to do to this thing. We need to bring it up to the level that the yeep is on now the yeep is essentially the yeep is essentially what this thing at the moment wishes it was and we need to do a couple of things to this thing just to make it a lot more usable so this is very simple it's literally just got a tc logo and says tc customs on the side there is nothing nothing like crazy going on with it so we're gonna turn that off we're gonna darken this layer and then we're going to uh we're gonna Select that, we're going to duplicate it, and then we're going to make it orange again. And once we make it orange again, we're going to move it back over that to make the surface uh, 3D. Good, good, good. And then now, let me go ahead and duplicate it again. And obviously, we're going to hit the limit. That's fine. So we hit the limit, we duplicate it, and then we bring it around to the other side. And we go ahead and drop it down right there. So she's good to go. And now that she's good to go, yeet, yip, right? Oh, my God. Let's see. Uh, Lisa Nichols, what's going on, dude? And you should build Yamaha Grizzly 700. How would I end up actually going about that? I mean, would it be, like, you mean with, like, realistic emblems and everything? Or, like, kind of something that looks like a Yamaha? So let's let's uh, let's move this into a slightly better position. Not too bad. Air decal might work. Oh, God. <laughs> Jeez, bud. That was actually literally the, the, the moment that I least expected you. Um, Perfect timing. I was about to say, of course, that probably means it just worked. Uh, but let me make this. Uh, let me finish doing my 3D text here. As long as I can make the 3D text work and not have the game decide to, like, blue stacks itself on me, then we should be A-OK. -okay. Now, I'm going to unmirror that. And then I'm going to copy it over to the other side because I built this thing before I knew how uh, decal mirroring worked and, you know, how duplication worked because I've decided I'm a blithering idiot sometimes. But let's see. Again, he says, oh, wait, what's up? Sorry, TC, I was not in the beginning of the stream. Oh, no worries, dude. You're you're out here now. Heck, yeah. Um, let's see. Why is slow mode set to... I didn't realize it was set... In... Is it actually set to one hour in the Discord? Um, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh god let's see squatter truck 15 is that a wait a minute is that oh that's a that that's a dodge i was like it's just the the angle of it looked odd digging the first gen and the f450 combo look at the speed bro you're towing that camper at like 80 by the way that's a, well i don't know if it's a camper or a race trailer but either way it's really really nice um i do also want to build a race trailer by the way gabe i see some uh oh god cody why the squatted tahoe Wow, let's see, Rocco with the nice, like, F-150 Raptor and the trailer setup, that looks really good. 
Really, really good. Let's see. Uh, we need triple tires. Triples would probably not fit. You know what I mean? Um, at least in most areas in Off-Road Outlaws, they would most likely not fit. Now, I'm trying to think. This Bronco, with it being as crazy as it is, I don't know if it works exactly as I want it to for what we're going for. But, but... Um, I'm going to, I'm going to let that be, and I'm going to grab the new GMC, and I wonder if Diesel, especially now that you're in here and you can share this with us, um, okay. have you put together a, well, I shouldn't say have you put together any new trucks, I feel like you've got a, you've got a few trucks that you've kept around, but do you have anything that you feel like could, um, stand up to both, you know, both trails, and then on the other side of that, drag racing. I know you've got drag racing setups. You literally don't even need to answer that, but... Mm. For a drag race? I've got trail rigs, like four I can think of, mm -hmm. but I don't know how they'd handle drag racing. I mean, well, they don't have to do trails and drag racing. They they just... <laughs> they. I, I meant... Um, I meant, like, you know, some for one approach and some for the other approach. Oh, yeah, I have... I have bunches that can do that. Sweet. Now let's see. Um, TC, I got a really good tune. I can pull a gooseneck with mo with a monster truck at forty five plus. Oh, that sounds awesome. Um, by the way, uh, by the way, Travis, I um, so I don't know if Diesel, I don't know if you've know, like you've probably seen this, but uh, Travis keeps asking about his server ban. Um, well, I keep forgetting. Like, to be perfectly honest, I've been really busy this week, so I haven't really had much of a chance to look into it. I know you're good. I, I tried to look into it as well, and I believe it was for um, posting and reposting the same link over and over and over again, and also, um, like, links to other servers. Um, and I, I, I know we don't normally, like, you know, normally that's that, but, like, I feel like it's, you know... It's worth talking about the fact that, like, it was against the rules and you did get strikes for it and you continued doing it. So that's kind of that's kind of where we reach a point of, like, well, th th there was a ban for a reason, you know? Exactly. Plus, if... I can't recall now... Uh, Travis, what was your Discord name? Because that might really... Like, we have a three-strike limit in the server. So if you used up all three strikes, then, you know, just like in baseball, you're out. <laughs> <laughs> and just like in Monopoly, you do not get to pass go or collect two hundred dollars. <laughs> yeah. Of course, I'm terrible at Monopoly. Sometimes I, I, well, I'm either really bad at it or I'm really good at it. Uh, it just depends on how you, well, roll the dice essentially. But let's see. Um. <laughs> okay, hold on. Let me go ahead and. Oh, he says, okay, I got kicked for spamming server links, but I rejoined and the ban was unfair. Okay, well, that's a totally different story. That's that that's a, that's wait, a direct disagreement a with the rules. Wait a second. Yeah, and that's actually one more thing, because if, if you got kicked, that means you hit strike number two, because after strike number two, you get an automatic kick from the server. No mm -hmm. mod did it, we gave you a strike, and then the bot kicks you from the server. Right. So, if you got banned then that was because you hit strike number three and you're out of the server. And you were doing the same thing over and over and over and over again. And I, I can't stress this enough. Doing the same thing over and over and over again is not how you... Uh, it's not how you set up a... Um, especially when you're breaking the rules over and over again. It's not how you make uh, the, the, the greatest, like, you know, entry into a community. You know what I mean? <laughs> But, yeah. and that's not to like, and oh, go ahead. I was just going to say, Travis, remind me, remind me what your Discord name was again, because I know you've told me before when you brought this up and I keep like, like I said, I, I got super busy, so I couldn't really look into it thoroughly. Yeah, because we can search you and we can look into it. We can look into it. Um, let's see. Um, after the kick, I didn't do anything. Uh, I just said I was saying things in the same category through two conversations so, interesting. Um, let's see. I would like to bring my Nova to your game. Uh, can we have the server link? Yeah, dude. So, the Discord server is up there in the top of the chat. It is pinned. And I'm actually looking at the, um, the Offered Atlas channel in the server right now. Seeing some brand new builds from Dirtbag Customs with the beautiful Dodge. Um, seeing Hurst with the gorgeous C10. 
gigantic side-by-side. -side. Loving that. And AK-1500. That also looks really, really good as well. You guys are dropping some sick builds today. Now, Cole just showed up with this setup, which is all dodge all the time. And I believe that is like... Well, it looks like it's either a 3500 or maybe even a, like a 4500, but... I mean, it just says Ram on the side, so I don't know exactly what to call it if he has a specific name for it other than the fact that it looks like a 3500. I'm loving the drag truck on the trailer, though. The drag truck on the trailer is like, that's pretty incredible. Maximum, or Maximus Yetus. There we go. Let's see. Um, what is, um, Diesel, you ready for a yeah. very odd, um... I don't understand, like, these back-to-back -back messages in the chat, but, like, this dude was like, my uncle has a Ford Escape, and then the next message was, I have a girlfriend, from the same account, and I'm like, odd message yeah. to follow up the other one with, like, I just, oh, whoa, dude, okay, I haven't yeah, built that's, a... Uh, I'm, I'm just gonna leave that one hanging there, <laughs> how about that? You're good. I have never built a like a limited Ford and this looks incredible. So I see how you do the gas cap now. He's got a proper gas cap, but with a little like, you know, some of them have the little flap on it that you can use to open them up. There's a little one he did it in like uh, with the little U piece right here. And then the limited right there on the bed. Limited like, well, okay, I got to tell you like, the only thing that's not really realistic about this build is that it's a limited dually, but it's a, it says F250. And I don't think that there's any 250s that would have like a big dually setup like that. But other than that, that truck's beautiful. I love this El Camino. You guys have been like, man, these builds today are, these builds today are next level. This looks straight out of um, No Limit Drag Racing. Straight out of No Limit. Like, oh man. That looks amazing. So good. And then we got a gorgeous uh, first gen showing up, painted axles and everything. Like, shows show build, but still somewhat usable. And let's see. Um, we've also got, like, literally we go back in here and, oh, he literally, like, parked at the garage. He just straight up, he was like, yep, I'm in the garage now. But no, like, I love how well, like, this setup fits with the other setup. I'm literally going to put the, um, like, the gas cap on my Chevy like the oh I get back in my truck and the game is like I'm gonna force you into a rotation I'm like <laughs> fair classic the El Camino is Cletus McFarlane's that's what I thought yeah he built mullet yo what were you gonna also, say I was just gonna say uh I did find well actually let me let me take this right here yes uh check DMs oh okay I got you, I got you. So, as far as, uh, is this, yeah, is this related to, uh, what we were discussing earlier? Um, yeah. Oh, you did, did you? Yep, and screenshots. All right. And, oh, 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 boy. All right, yep, yep that holds up. Um, yep. that holds up, I get it. TC, why are the shotties a thing on Alfred Outlaws? Um, honestly, because when the birds are really close to you, it, they're very easy to hit with the shoddy. I mean, they're extremely easy. Now, obviously, when they start to get a little bit further away from you, uh, they're not as easy to hit anymore. But let me go back down to where I did That's the... That's why Alfred Outlaws should add an RPG. Was that out loud? Yes! Um, that was... <laughs> Let's see. Jake Shores with 199 Super Chat. Thank you so much. Hey, DC, uh, can I join your game? I want to show you a Nova. Um, we're going to be doing many, many, many more rounds, Jake. So make sure that if you haven't yet, you join the Discord server and you post a picture of it in there. And then you can also come into any of these open lobby rounds um, between the truck builds and show it to us as well. So let's see. I just built a toy hauler that I used to own. Heck yeah, Bro Cuts Long Care. Welcome back, dude. Thank you for stopping back by. And let's see. I was on with the drag dodge. That's awesome, Gabriel. That's so good. Wait, why time out my cat stepped on my keyboard? Uh, I, I has big doubt. <laughs> <clears throat> no comment. All right, hold on. Uh, let me make that white. And, oh, there we go. Oh, God. Also, oh. keep the random codes out of the chat, guys. We do that to protect the safety and privacy safety and of security. the viewers. Yeah, sec yeah safety, safety, security, and privacy of the viewers. 
Indeed, because uh, let's just say that there have been issues before with people doing, shall we say, uh, a bit of fishing. Um, <laughs> yo, <Yeah>. that <laughs> that actually looks and, like a real uh, gas cap. Not going now. to it any more than that. <laughs> yeah, no, seriously, like I, that's that's literally that's as far as I was gonna go into it. Um, but let's see. Um, I'm trying to send my truck on the Discord, uh, but it won't let me. Can you help? Um, so before you can post in the Discord, if you've just joined, you literally have to go and um. Um, agree to the rules, and then you should be able to post. TC, I keep getting a slow mode error on Discord, and I can't see anything. Uh, that's because on the Discord, there is obviously a slow mode to prevent spam, but that means you've also already posted. Um, what I can do is I can actually, I may reduce the, um, I may reduce the slow mode a little bit. Not a ton, not a ton, but a little bit. Oh, Phoenix, that El Camino is gorgeous. Bro, that looks so good. Um, I'm going to reduce the slow mode just a little bit, but I'll tell you one thing. If the spam gets crazy, we will put it back up. Um, we, we will put it back up, and we will put it back up very quickly uh, if spam is just, like, repeatedly over and over and over again. So let's see. We got a... Looks like we got a tank up on top of a, like... Um, like a field find that looks awesome. Um, I'm also seeing a... Let's see. Taffy with the huge monster Chevy... I don't know about those wheels, but let's see. I wish you could change the amount of the doors on the cars. Oh, absolutely. Like a two-door Bronco or a four-door Wrangler. Like, those would be... Like, and I've said this um, many times before, that I think that would be probably the biggest step forward for uh, the game as a whole. So let's see. Um, I'm going to actually... Uh, I'm going to actually grab this guy right here. And I am going to wipe it out because I that Seaboys TV truck did not turn out very well. And I think I'm gonna do a like kind of a similar um kind of a similar direction with this build as the guy that I saw with the um oh god, what was it? Not the platinum, not the platinum. Oh my gosh, the guy from the previous lobby. It was a Bro, I can't even remember what, like, edition of Ford that was. VR Jax and Jake Wood, what's limited? up? The Limited. Yes, the Limited. Okay, I built so many Platinums before that I forgot what a Limited was. Um, Let me do, like, a... It limited your decision, basically. Uh, <laughs> my decisions are limited. Um, Let's see. <laughs> Larry's Classic Customs with 199 Super Chat. Thank you so much, Ford or Chevy. Honestly, I like both. I think they've both got a lot of different... um. A lot of different ups and downs. Um, there's definitely no uh, perfect brand out there. Uh, you know what I mean? So with with that being said, though, with there being no, like, um, no perfect brand out there, that's not to say that, like, you know, you can't like one brand uh, more than another. But um, I'm going to actually look up F350 Limiteds and see if I can, um, let's see, if I can do a like a similar setup to one man the limited oh we could do a we could do a tremor oh i didn't even think about that we could totally do a tremor oh man i i am totally down for that oh that's awesome so let's see f350 tremor that's gonna be basically like you could do it in a single tone or a two-tone and I think I'm going to do it in the two-tone. I've got an example photo pulled up and make a bouncy truck. I don't know about that. Um, let's see. BC Customs. Uh, I can't get in the Discord. Um, have you had any issue, uh, issues getting into it before? Mini Jeepers Adventures and Wolfman1016. Uh, 1016. What's up, you guys? Okay. So let me do a, what is it going to be? Like a darker red? Okay. So base color is going to be a darker red, like about there. And it'll be, like, glossy. And then I'll apply that. I'm going to be applying things literally as I go. So do keep that in mind. Now, I know that I'm going to go a little bit out of the, like, outside the norm here and do a, um, let's see, BC Custom says, no, I haven't. Um, So does it say you have, um, does it say you can't join? Or is it giving you an error message or anything like that? We definitely need window stickers as well. Window stickers... I, I don't understand why they haven't done window stickers yet. Like, I think window stickers could be the best thing to ever happen to, like, Offered Outlaws. Like, I I love the idea of window stickers being a thing in this game. So, I'm going to size this down. And, 
I cannot stress enough how hard this is to do with a mouse and keep it even. Like, <laughs> it is... <laughs> Diesel, you know you you know this feel. Um, yes. It, this is... Th this happens to me in SnowRunner modding because it's like, okay, the rim is too big. Adjust it. Oh, now it's too small. Too big, too small. Ugh. Yeah, exactly. Too big, too small, too big, too small, too big, too small. And you're like... You're like, someone just please, please help. Like, <laughs> all right. Yes. So there's that. Like that, that's and a then... big reason a lot of the parts and trucks take so long is it's like, no, this piece is not accurate. I must fix. Yeah, exactly. Like, okay, so I'm going to duplicate it and move it down the, the side of the truck. Although, you know, I got to tell you, I probably should have set the color first and it's got to be like a brown. Um, actually quite like that. So like a darker brown down on the side and I need to, oh, grand. Oh, I've got to do that now on this. Hold on. Brown. Wait. Oh, crud. Oh, now I've, now I have mismatched shades of brown. Oh, great. Oh, wait, I got it. I got it about as close as I was going to get it. All right. Duplicate it again. And boom. Like th this is one thing I really, boom. really don't like about Off-Road Outlaw's system. Uh -huh. Is you go to match the colors. Like on the wheels, for example. Right. And it's like, why can't I just have an option to use an existing color? Like Forza does. I would, just like, yeah, I, would, I would love that. Yeah, I would love that. Because I'll go in there for any other color than black, and it's like, okay, great, this is perfect, or any color in between the two ends of the spectrum, and then this is perfect, and I go back, and I notice the slider is not correct, and it's like, Ugh. It's like, why this is are driving you... me nuts. You're like, why you do this to me? <laughs> yes. All right, so I've got the lower part of it done. The tremor is coming along. I just can't stand for the rears to not have a dually option and be... Okay, it is a massive... Zachary Roach and Mikey and Tom, what's up? And let's see, uh, J.R. Fal uh, Falcons, a country girl, what's going on, you guys? Thank you so much for stopping by. Um, like in No Limit. Wait, so does No Limit have a color matching option? That would be great. Can you do a truck meet, please? Oh, don't worry. We have a bunch of truck meet rounds coming up. We just finished one. We're about to rotate into another one. And, of course, we have the Discord truck meet going on as we speak. Like, for example, the... Oh, God. There is a, there is a mega squat, like, K1500 in there. Um, let's see. Very nice F350 as well. Gorgeous blue F350. Slammed out second gen. Oh, dude. Um, I'm loving these builds. We got Chase with his, like, number six dirt bike. That's awesome. David with his flatbed Duramax. Flexing the Chevy out. Bryant. Um, James Craven. I don't know if you built that Chevy to look like a pulling truck, but it looks like a pulling truck. Also, Rescue Squad 22. Digging the Ford, dude. And, K really? Karen? What? <laughs> Chevy says, like, Karen calls on it. What the heck? All right. That's a... All right. That's a thing. Um, I don't know how to respond to that. Bruh. <laughs> so let's throw a nice... Here we go. This is where this gets fun. Now, why is it upside down? Bro, why are you... Now, the tremor text. Is the tremor text itself, like... Oh, what is it? It's like... Oh, it's got a like a like its own specific look to it, but it's like red and black at the same time. I can't find a picture that's a close up of the. Okay, so it's red on the bottom, but then black on the top layer. So let's see. Um, so we have the tremor right here, and that's gonna be weird because this truck is red already. So I'll make the bottom layer blue, and then I'll duplicate, and I'll make the top layer black, and so it'll have that kind of, like, um, like, back glow look. There we go. That's exactly how that was supposed to come out. That's exactly what that was supposed to look like. TC, can you build a, uh, a Toyota 4Runner? We definitely could do one in the future. Um, let's see. Big boy yeet. What's up? Let's see. <laughs> Sorry, I thought that was a so text ball for a minute. Oh, no, you're good. It literally said big boy yeet. Um, and there was literally, like, 
nothing other than that. Like, but I could totally see how, how like, you would have looked at it and immediately gone, Oh, God, it's a spam wall. All right. Tremor right there. And then we'll get the other one. We'll duplicate it. We'll bring it around. And let's see if we can get it to... Oh. Yes, there it is. There it is. You can totally give it that, like, backlit look if you really, really, like, really, really try. If you really put that into it. Um, let's see. Bottom layer brown. Yeah, right? Pretty much. Um, let's see. Yeah, but specifically regular car reviews brown. Like, mm, when he was talking about an era of, like, it was, like, late 90s, or no, sorry, late 80s, early 90s Chrysler, I think it was. I'll never forget, like, the phrase that he used because... He was like, Chrysler provided an experience that allowed you to walk into the dealership, sit down with a salesman, and option out your favorite shade of brown. <laughs> and I was like, <laughs> oh, I just, I don't, I don't know why that's so funny to me, but it is. Like, <laughs> are you going to yeet toilet paper again? Uh, well, considering that I don't have any, like, sitting right next to me, like, <laughs> right now um i i i don't know if i'm going to today but you never know what we might uh what we might yeet today so let's see lift it i don't know i mean i oh i really i really don't know we've got to figure out exactly what direction we're gonna go with the good old tremor here but let's see. Um, I have a build request hey throw it out there in the chat and let's see eating spicy instant noodle um you know what uh you know what's a spicy instant noodle? My driving when I drive off a cliff in SnowRunner. Um, <laughs> <laughs> like, that's what... That's, oh, man. I need I need a truck in SnowRunner with, like, an engine option named Instant Spicy Noodle. That that needs to be an engine option. I, I would use that every single time just purely on the principle of what it is. Um, wait. Mr. Camer says, TC, you're ignoring my... Hold on. Um, you're ignoring my question. I want to show you my truck. I can't get Discord, so please do a private map so I can join and show you my truck. Here's the thing. Um, it's really hard for me to do, like, just, uh, private lobbies in this game because, like, one of the major reasons for that is, like, genuinely because all of the, uh, the lobbies that we host are handled through Discord. So... It's extremely difficult for me to set up anything that is private without the user being in the Discord in the first place. And even then, it's really, like, we don't usually do a lot of specifically private scenarios, um, you know, as well. So, let's see. There's a couple of trucks I get I can't bring out unle unless you don't read the tailgate. Uh, yeah, Prince, those should probably stay in your garage. Um, let's see. <laughs> that'd be amazing. And Rose, EXE6. Oh, God, that's a name. What's up? See you saying hi. Elijah Gaming, what's going on out there in the chat thank you for stopping by we got shadow with the all right guys um let's see hold on shadow op with the very glowy setup um let's see treadhog 195 nice builds um one thing to remember guys um is in the discord server um the, i did back off the slow mode um and i made it a lot more open however i will say um in order for us to keep that slow mode where it is right now um i would recommend posting your trucks as single photos rather than giant walls of like a bunch of photo files okay it makes it a lot easier for people to interact along with what what you're doing and just have a uh an easier time chatting with both me and each other so maverick stone what's up dude thank you so much for stopping by and let's see should I add trophy rear to the front wait what you mean like the trophy truck rear axle like but in the front interesting um we're gonna lift this thing a little bit I don't know how much we're going to lift it. I'm going to try to make this one, like, fairly realistic. Um, and when I say fairly realistic, I actually do mean it this time. I know that I've been accused of using terms like, oh, yeah, I'm going to make this truck fairly realistic. And then, like, it rolls out of the shop and it looks like, you know, <laughs> it looks like, you know, Yeet Machine 9000. But I feel like Diesel and I both have that same issue when we're like, yeah, Pretty much. realistic yeah. build. And then, you know, it rolls out of the shop and it's like, yep, um, we've got, it's like, so this is our 10,000 horsepower rocket turbine. Um, <laughs> let's see, I'm going to shock size this one up just a little bit. 
that's not bad. I feel like we're definitely still within that realism um, space, especially with the way the truck looks right now. Um, I need a little bit more height out of the front, but not much. Um, there we go. That looks better. That looks so much better. Um, now I'm going to do a little bit more wheel. Not much though. Um, a little bit more. I'm thinking like 1.3. Just want to do a nice like tasteful build. This is going to be one of those trucks where I think it can, it, I think it'll actually be um, something that you would be able to see on the road in real life and actually look at it and go, dang, that's a clean truck, you know? So with up front, we're going to go with like a... I'm thinking like a 1.2. Again, like nothing super crazy. And frankly, the tire size is is actually pretty close to stock. But that's not a bad thing. That's actually, uh, I think, really, really usable. Um, I don't think the stock tire size gets enough love in uh, in Offered Outlaws, you know? I can't put my truck in the Discord. Uh, TMK Gaming, what is the uh, what is uh, Discord telling you? What's the issue? Um, you mean I got 30 monitors? Wait, what do you mean I got 30 monitors if if wait on Discord? What? Whoa, 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 I whoa. Think, I think that was spell check. Oh, okay. A I think he meant 30 minutes. Okay, okay. I got you, I got you. That build is very similar to mine. Uh, they would look sick next to each other. Oh, that's awesome, dude. Ray plays with the one nine nine super chat. Thank you so much, ADZ. I love your videos. You make awesome content. Thank you so much. I really appreciate you, dude. Um, Yeet Machine 9000. Yeah, always. Always the Yeet Machine 9000, my dudes. All right, the Tremor is coming along, and I really like where we're going with it. The realistic Tremor has wheels that are... I mean, I don't know. The, the wheels are... Um, they're cool for a stock wheel, but they're not quite what I'm looking for. So in that same vein, um, let's do a, I want to look at a lifted one again, and I want to get some inspiration behind the wheels. So, yo, ho, 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 God. Oh, dude. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Let's see. Are you camping? Oh, definitely at some point in the, um, in the stream, for sure. We've got a bunch of campers that were absolutely like, Absolutely down to use for sure. Now let's get the wheel situation sorted out. Now here's what I'm going to do with the wheels. I think that it would be really cool to do something kind of deep dish, but not necessarily, not necessarily like super over the top, if that makes any sense. So let's see about a, I mean, maybe that, but it's not like, wait a second. Hold on. How does this look, but with the bead being chrome and the face being black? I don't, I don't know about it. I don't like it. Uh, BC Customs, um, let me know out the, uh, let's see. I can't join the Discord. I've seen you repost that over and over again, but I really, I need to know what Discord is telling you. Um, because... Depending on what Discord is telling you, that can have a major impact on why it won't let you join. You know what I mean? Um, so if you could just uh, put that out there in the chat, that would be absolutely wonderful. Now, let's see. Can we do a... Let's see. Ooh, 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 that's nice. Um, let me do... Not matte black. Hold on. Chrome black on the, uh, on the bead itself. And then the face, I'm going to do a matte black. And I think that that wheel is definitely deeper, so I'm going to do that in the front. And let's see. There we go. It's a much deeper dish. Oof. I'm... What's up? The comment I'm taking out. Oh, That's God. The... Yikes. Did yikes happen? <laughs> <laughs> I mean... Oh, oh dear on. God. I, I just saw it. Thing. Oof. Um, let's see. Also, check it back into the Discord. We got Larry's Classic Customs throwing down a, looks like a, um, looks like a CUDA. And then we've also got a new side-by-side. -side. Got an OBS Ford from Mr. Nut. And a, um, a, let's see. We got a nice square body from him as well. That, that square body literally is on fire. It's literally got flames on it. Another squatted OBS Ford landing with a nice F-350. Looks like a, looks like it's kind of going after that, like, two-tone kind of King Ranch look. Nice old Bronco Braden as well. Very cool. Let's see. I just realized I was not live. Uh, I was not live. Oh dear. Um. Oh geez. Jake Shorts is literally triple ooing in the chat. Oh god. <laughs> so let me see. 
What do we think, guys? Do we go with the black on chrome or the black on chrome black? That is like, let me know. What do you like better, the look of the front or the look of the rear? I'm split, to be honest. Like, um, I'm having a really good day, Maverick Stone. How about you? Black chrome. I'm definitely thinking black chrome. The black chrome, I think, just sets it off a little bit better. Um, all right. So, front wheels, bead mirror there we go oh dude there we go oh man i'm i'm digging this tremor already like this this thing is this thing is here to um this thing is here to party dude absolutely here to party t edwards what's up dude thank you so much for stopping by oh dude we're getting close we're, we're getting really close with this build now we need a set of tires that look really really good and I'm thinking, so these always look really good. These always look really good as well. Um, what about, how about this? So these are kind of like a Mickey Thompson Baja Pro kind of style. I usually don't use them on dualies uh, or really anything with lower profile tires. But I think those look really, really good. And now we need to do, yeah, we need to do the classic, uh, we need to do the decals on the door. David Harrison, Roman's videos, what's up, dude? Meaty tires will look pretty slick. Heck yeah, they're definitely pretty meaty for the size that they are. But I'm going to actually throw on the side right there um, F350 but it's going to go down the edge. So check out how we do this. This is going to be interesting. So it'll be a little bit tricky to line up, but I think that once we get it all done, I think it'll look really, really good. I think it'll look really, really good, actually. So let me do kind of like a ghost letter color. Um, maybe a little bit brighter on there. And the only tricky part that about this... Weird. What's up? I just had a major lag out, and my my Chrome crashed entirely. You crashed entirely? Yeah, like the stream froze, chat froze, and disconnected. I couldn't refresh. Nothing. Good it just Lord. gave up. That is, that's actually really bad. Like, that's really, really, really bad. Uh, all right, so F three fifty. Okay, now I can get the color. To where I want it. Okay, this is so many like vinyl items, but I mean it's gonna be it's gonna be worth it. Oh <gasps> dude, dude, that came out exactly the right size. Now obviously we can't put it in the little emblem pocket right there, but we got a base out there in the chat. Oh yo, what's up? And let's see, um, Will Diesel X and Baker and Hayden and Bugsy, uh, or sorry, Buggy. What's up, dude? How did you get that much money? Um, well, I work a lot with the Offered Outlaws developers, and we do a lot of, um, like, back and forths, um, in-game, and they help support the channel with, uh, like, in-game gold and cash and stuff like that, so we are able to, uh, do more builds like this one for you guys. Now, I really dig what we've got going on there with the F-350. Now, here's my question, chat. How quickly do you think Off-Road Outlaws will crash if I try to make that entire F-350 emblem 3D? Like, <laughs> that is... Ooh. Wow. Huh? I said, wow, this is, uh... This is weird. I'm gonna have to restart the PC. I'll be back in a few. Really? Jeez, all right. Dang, yep. I didn't realize that. Well, good luck with it. All right, let me see. Yep. BRB. All right. Oh, here we go. We're going to have a fully 3D F350 logo. Dude, I am... I, I'm going to be proud of this build. I'm going to be so proud of this. Uh, Let's see. Almost there. And almost done. Oh, my God. Dude. Uh, and just I say that, it fixes itself. It literally fixed itself? Bro. Yep. <laughs> I don't know why, but... <gasps> Dude, that came out so good. Now we have to do it on the other side. But that's okay. Let's see. How did Don't How did it? Prince do that? <laughs> how did Prince do what? He posted his trucks in the server. Oh, did he? Hold on one sec. Whoa! Dude, look at that. Well, wait a minute. Uh I mean they're super color coordinated, but what are you trying to figure out how he did? Like the text? Like everything about him. They're just such cool looking machines. Yeah, honestly, and actually, they also look too. Sick. Look at his XP level. <laughs> look at his XP. Wait, like hold that, on. that's the main thing. 
Oh dear His God! XP on the game. <laughs> That's nuts, <laughs> bro. Dude probably like grinded the crap out of the game. Um, let's see, two hundred twenty-two. Very very nice. Do like kind of like two two tone. Dual tone um, setups. Loving your Raptor. Big truck go blah. I, bro, that's a great username. Big truck go blah. Um, <laughs> oh, that's so good. It says I don't have permission to send messages to this channel. You just got to do, um, you just got to like go and agree to the rules. And then after that, you should be good to go. Um, BC Customs says the error I'm getting says error. Well, does it give you um, any, any more details than the error I'm getting says error? Yeah, it, that it. We need a little bit more detail than error. Yeah, the, the, the that's, like that could be any one of a number of things. That's like that's like uh, that's like Snowrunner uh, like devs replying to mod stuff. Wait, what? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I'm just like, you know. All right, we got to do this F350 logo on the other side. We know could be a problem could not be a problem. Literally, it says that in the error logs. Yeah. Um, we know the sizing is right, so we'll be okay there. Uh, so let me get that done. And then we got one more. And then we just got to duplicate the 3D objects. Briar, what's up, dude? And let's see. I'm waiting on a code. LOL. Yeah, I trust me. Uh, I am I am trying to <laughs> not ruin this F350, Prince. I'm actually trying to do a build that I can be, like, properly... Pre no! You! You! I! Ugh! Ugh! <laughs> the second I try to do a build that I'm actually proud of. Ugh! Oh my god. Welcome I, to Blender Crashes. I I uh I get it. Wait, Garrett says 350s don't have dualies, only 450s and 550s. Bro, wait, 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 what? You've uh... You're telling me you haven't seen a you haven't seen an F350 dually? They're like everywhere, bro. Um, like, I could honestly probably go to the grocery store right now and see at least one F-350 dually. Um, and that's, I'm not even exaggerating when I say that. So, let me go back into the decals section, and just as long as I remember to save regularly, um, let me grab that. And I'm going to try to do this quickly. Uh, let's see. I remember it crashed when I got to the 5. So, wait. I can't remember. Did it crash on the 5 or crash on the 0? I'm trying to do it really fast. So, let me do the 5 and then save it. Right or not. Uh, 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 all right. Now, now, we're going to back out. We're going to save. Then we're going to come back in. So, even if it does crash, then we'll be good to go. So, back into decals. And then we got the zip. You're going to crash now after I've saved you? Okay, no, you're good. God, it <laughs> I'd be like, well, joke's on you if you crash now, game, because I just saved my work. Um, Wait, let's see. Certify <laughs> certified blue stacks uh, moment. Let's see. 35, uh, 350s almost come standard in dually unless you don't want it. Yeah, it's it's in a lot of areas. Um, It's harder to find a single wheel F350 than it is to find a dually one. I mean, and I honestly feel like I'm not exaggerating on that at all. Um, let me get the 3D stuff done. Almost there. And, dude, stacking all of this is like... Uh, yeah, it crashed again. <laughs> Oof. Ah! Uh, at least we saved, right? At least we saved. Like, I'm not that mad about it. Mm. Uh, Zero Dead Boy, um, he's asking when is the truck meet? Um, so we have a bunch of truck meets that are happening all throughout the stream, but um, uh, essentially what we uh, what we do is we host a meet round, and then we come back in, and we do a lot of builds, and then we look at the builds in the Discord, and then we go back and do another truck meet round, and then we come back and do some more building, then we look at it in the Discord. Um, there's a lot of different uh, stages to this, but thank you so much for taking part. Oh my god! My game crapped out on me last month. Look at that. What? Diesel, look what Larry posted in the Discord. That makes me uncomfortable. Um, <laughs> wow. I'm waiting for it to load. I'm having another lag issue. Okay. I don't know what's going on, but... You're good. Uh, Yo, Murder Nova looking sick. Larry? Zulzi with the, uh, with the K3500. Very nice build. Ooh, very nice. Also, Light Cake 420 on the old school Chevy. Very, very nice. 
loving the builds. Um, yeah, Larry, we have we have some questions for you. Um, <laughs> yes, M many, 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 many questions. <laughs> how how you did what you did is well. Not only is it beyond me, but like. I feel like if you sent that to the Offered Outlaws developers, they'd be like, we're not mad. We're just impressed, you know? Um, because at that, like, once you get to that level, I mean, that's like, that's like, that's, that's premium, premium wacko at that point. <laughs> you have officially achieved like premium wacko status that is absolutely freaking great that is hilarious all right now comes the process where we attempt to make both sides 3d and i am going to save on this is this is probably going to seem excessive but i'm going to save on every single letter i'm literally i'm literally going to save every single duplication and it's about to go again, isn't it? Oh, nope. Oh, it froze up like it was about to go, but it didn't. Oh, my God. Now, I'm just trying to get it, like, all lined up-ish. Okay, we're good. Now, we're saving on that one. Again, this might seem very excessive, but trust me, it 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 it, it will pay off. Um, let's see, Logan and Axton, what's going on, you guys? Thank you so much for stopping by. And let's see, um, how do you do the two tone paint? Um, I did it with some duplicated uh stripes. So the like duplicated stripes are how I create that uh that uh two tone look. So back in, and I believe now we're on the five. You literally have to do it one at a time. Otherwise, you risk actual like catastrophic failure. Um, the, uh, the blue stacks crash rate is about, or I should say the reliability rate for blue stacks and crashing on offered outlaws is pretty similar to the reliability rate of a six O's head gaskets. Like seriously. All right. I need to flip this thing around to the other side. If you'll, Oh, Oh, why you? Oh God. That's a good point. You might want to save it. <laughs> Hold on. Uh, apply mods. Okay, I don't know what I did. Yeah, save it. Yeah, don't worry. Um, have you seen, oh, like, uh, Whistling Diesel's videos with the G-Wagon? Yes. Yes, I have. And, and like... Oh, did he get a G-Wagon now? Yes. <laughs> oh, boy. Um, apparently, he jumped it, like, 90-something feet. Um, I don't know how it survived, but, like, it drove afterwards. Um... Now, granted, it's it's worth noting that, like, he did it in the sand dunes, and so it wasn't, like, 90-something feet from flat ground to flat ground, but still. All right. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go ahead and let that be. I've got it. I've got it 3D'd on both sides. I've got it 3D on both sides. Shoo! Oh, God. Silas, what's up, dude? I see you saying hi out there in the chat. He's using a G-Wagon for what it was built for. Yes. <laughs> mm. Yes. Let's see. He dropped it on a new house. It was, okay, it was actually, I, it was a shed. <laughs> it was a shed, though. Now, here, I got a question for y'all. Do I leave the suspension uh, red like it is, or do I mess with it a little bit? Now, a real-world tremor would be basically, like, all blacked out like that. But I don't know about the all blacked out arms. I feel like that's a little bit, um, I don't know. I feel like it's a little bit much, if that makes sense. Um, what about like, like a gray? I actually kind of dig the gray. The gray, the gray looks pretty good. It almost looks kind of realistic in the way that like it wouldn't be, you know, it wouldn't be super heavily painted like from, you know, from the factory or anything like that. Yeah, no no worries, uh, Big Truck Go Bois, of course. Check Discord. Oh, don't worry. We're jumping back in in just a moment. And let's see. Yo, we got Jackson with that uh, Adventure Design uh, F450. Bubbles, look at that collection. The freaking Hoonigan Bronco with the tracks looking absolutely sick. Got a realistic Ford by Car Parking Boss. Is it bad that I read that as... In my head, I read it as car parking hoss. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, <laughs> no worries, car parking hoss. <laughs> it just, uh, let's see, BC Customs says, 
it just says error. Um, hey, I mean, I don't know. Um, I don't know why that would be. Um, I don't know why it would just be saying error. All right. Suspension black or red? We're doing a poll. Black, red. All right. Let okay, me know. Continue. Keep in mind that that uh, when I say black, I mean like a really, really dark gray. But let me know on that poll what you guys think. Because again, this is the realistic tremor we're talking about here. Like this thing is... You know, it was done in a realistic style. It was done in a realistic way. And we're... Wow! Oh, thank you, Garrett. I really appreciate you, buddy. Thank you so much. Oh, that's like really close. Ah, a lot of people are saying keep it black. Man, I'm not voting. I'm voting maroon. Uh, Tremor is just an option package. Yeah, um... You haven't experienced real pain until you've had a max decal livery crash on you twice. This is why we save... Banana, I cannot stress this enough to you. This is why we save. That is, I mean, yes, that is actual absolute pain. But I, I cannot stress this enough. This is why we save our game and our livery. Like, bruh, please. No. Why did that duplicate? I didn't want you to duplicate. All I want to do is right at 350 on my tailgate and go on my merry way. All right, hold on. Here we go. Set you right there. Good. And then the gray will be the background. But before we duplicate again, I'm going to save because I know that at this point when I'm this heavy, like this heavily loaded on decals, um, it, it can, it, the, like stuff can happen at any given moment. So duplicate. Black it out. And 3D. Very nice. That gives a good amount of extra, like, boldness to it. All right. That is going to be... Let's see. It duplicated because you pressed duplicate. That... Duh. Yes. Duh. Uh, let's see. Saving that much waste... So waste so much money. Ah, that's true. So, as far as that poll goes, it was very, very, very close. Um, let's see. Are you... I don't know. I don't know, Cosmo VR. <clears throat> Are you? <laughs> red is sus. That's all I'm gonna say about that. But red is always sus. So, what's up, Case and CJ? Thank you for stopping by. Man, am I happy with how this came out or what? Dude, like... This came out amazing. I, wow. I'm very, very happy with it. Very, 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 very happy with it, dude. Like, I don't think it could have come out any better. You should see the Dodger that I built. It's a maxed out second gen with mud tires. Very, very nice, dude. Very nice. All right, so we got this guy right here. We got the Ford loaded into the TC Camping Toy Hauler. And... I am very curious to see what uh, to see what Prince has been telling us about all throughout the stream. Now, I'm gonna go on to Twin Rivers Lake because Twin Rivers Lake is literally one of the biggest, like, it's one of the best realistic kind of testing ground slash RP areas. But I think Prince has some stuff in store for us that uh, should prove to be a very good time. Uh, let's see. So, black 58%, red 41%. Glad to see YouTube still can't percentage properly. It's it's a thing. <laughs> I I don't know, Rose. I can't explain it. You know, I'm not inside its brain. I can't explain it. I I wish I could. One question, TC. How do you agree to the rules in the Discord? Uh, we have a channel for that. Um, literally where it says rules, um, you can go in there, and I believe you just have to, like, click a... Um, you just have to, like, click one of the reactions, and that'll just accept it for you. Oh my god. I love this setup. I love it even more knowing that, like, I'm just ripping at super high speeds, even with a freaking F-350 on the trailer. Now, obviously, I know that that's because it's a pool behind and not a gooseneck, but I also need to go in and tune the gears on that tremor really, really soon because I haven't had a chance to tune the gears on it yet, so gear tuning can really help you a lot. I very narrowly avoided that tree. That was bad. 
Bro, that was so bad. Um, Banana, I, we could probably do, I, I think we, because I know that we've been building a lot of similar trucks, so I think we're going to do uh, you and Prince on this round, and then once we do that, then we'll open it up um, as an open lobby round, and then of course I'm going to go back through the, um, go back through the Discord as well. So let me back this thing up, and let me also make sure that, whoa, easy. These pull-behinds should not be easier to back up than the goosenecks. They should not be, but they are. And it's like, it's actually almost annoying how much easier these are to back up. Because it's like, bro, they, they shouldn't be that easy to back up. All right, let's go ahead and hop right on out. Now... This is where things get properly interesting because we're about to see not only these very, very, like, very long-term builds, but we're also about to see the builds that uh, that Prince and Banana have been working on. What is good, Santa and Sucks? I see you out there in the chat. Thank you so much for stopping in with us. We genuinely appreciate you. Huh? Oh, yeah. So let's see. Let me go ahead and uh, we got to grab a couple of things right here. All right. couple of invites um, are going out. And then once that one goes out, we also got the other one about to go out. Y'all are about to see some very interesting rigs. And when I, see, when I say very interesting uh, rigs, very, very interesting rigs. All right. So I'm just making sure that my invites are correct which they should be, and all right, it's time to send it. It is always time to send it around. What's up, wireless? Is he out there checking in with us? I think you meant to say toilet paper, but you said toily paper instead. Um, oh, <laughs> they, they've, uh, toily paper? Uh, they've both arrived. I'm really, really, really hoping that this does not result in a crash arena. Um, why did you spawn, like, on the other side of the truck? Just offer an outlaws things, I guess. Um, oh, yeah, God. Yeah, that's, that's offering outlaws. Yeah. I do you remember stuck? you, dude. Huh? Like, the very first thing I see is your truck seeming to be stuck up against the fence. Uh, stuck up against the fence and not the color it was when I started. <laughs> Oof. Yeah. It's oh, actually, now. that's typical. That does that to me all the time. Yeah, I don't know why it does that. Like, it flashes the opposite color. Um, let's see. Uh, do you remember me from the last stream? I do indeed, wireless. Uh-huh. Absolutely. Sheila Bradley, what's up? Yo, we got Banana101 pulling in with the, uh, what is that? The Attitude trailer. Very nice. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I hit the wrong button, Banana. I am so sorry. <laughs> I, <laughs> I forgot to put, like, a repair pack in here. I love the ladder, dude. The ladder is the best. The ladder's so good. Not only is it so good, but, like, it fits it so well. All right, I'm going to actually hop out as well. And Banana is like... Oh, no! I knew it! I knew it! Uh, I, I, I heard the game, That's... like... Yeah, I heard it get a little weird, and then it went... Bam! Um, but, um, I'm gonna actually, Oof. I remember what the invite was, so I'm gonna hop right back in there, and it should bring me right back in, like, instantly, so, um, if, like, if those guys are in there, did make sure they don't go anywhere. Um, let's see, Ethan Mason, welcome back, dude, thank you so much for stopping back by with us, also, you guys are about to blow through that 200 likes mark of the stream, thank you again so much, alright, real quick, we're gonna do a re-entry into that session, Hopefully, all goes well. Uh, let's see. Did it grenade it on me, or did it actually work? So, let's see. Oh, oh, nope. I'm joining back. Let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Carl Kellogg, welcome back. Also, while this is loading up, I'm going to check the Discord again. We got a Jeep buggy by Car Parking Boss. What's up? Yo, another uh, two-tone F-350 build. Super sick. GOI Ram 10, and let's see. We got a little Diesel X with another uh, very interesting Raptor. Um, nice second gen, nice cat eye. The most massive cowboy hat ever on top of a Willys Jeep. Mini Jeeper once again with that uh, Jeep buggy. Um, very nice Ford 4x4 uh, F350 with the trailer and the side-by-side. -side. Man, y'all are absolutely just ripping with those um, with those custom builds today. Um, let's see. Hannah Snow, what's up? Hi, boy. Yeah, right? 
All right, well, let me make the trek back to where the other two are at because let's just say um, my game oofed itself the first time. All right, uh, let's see. And so we'll see when you get back. Oh, boy. I heard Cat Eye. Yeah, that was, I mean, was that your truck? Um, oh, boy. Hold on. All right, I'm trying to get up there without running into an issue. Why is this truck so drift happy? Like, even with the trailer behind it, it just wants to slide around all over the place. I feel like they're probably just right back at that same yard. Yep, they are. Prince is there, and Banana is there as well. What's up, Tara? Welcome back. Charlotte Hines? All right, well, we will see when you get back. Thank you so much. Oh, boy. Twin Rivers Lake just crashed my blue stacks, bruh. Hey, it happens, you know? It, it, it does, in fact, happen. Yo, Prince, that setup is gnarly. Your tires have yet to render for me. Okay, now they are. I love this whole, like, two-tone theme you've got going on. That's so sick. That's wild. All right, let me actually uh, disconnect my trailer up here and detach. So, or rather, switch vehicles. So, let me go ahead and do a quick switch. And boom, boom. I don't know why I need the lockers on. I mean, probably because, like, putting the lockers on is just like a, oh, my God, stop. Okay, there we go. Putting the lockers on is just like a normal reaction for me, but... Oh, yeah, that setup is the... Oh! Did he crash out? Did... Wait. Um, um... They both crashed out at the exact same time. How? I don't understand that. Bro, I, I don't understand how they both crash out at the same time. I mean, I guess you could say Offered Outlaws things, but jeez, bro. Let's see... Yeah, wireless? Wow, that is terrible. That is... Oh, God. So, oh, and then I just got, I just crashed out, pr presumably, when they tried to rejoin. All right, I think that's a sign that I'm going to do just another, like, open lobby round. And um, General Poppinlock says, well, I never crash. And I'm like, I mean, probably because you're on a mobile device. <laughs> um... Oh, God, Kyle Wyatt. I don't know what... I mean, I'm sure that this is a... I feel like that's a loaded question, honestly. I was, Yeah, I was about to say, I'm going to not answer that just yet, you know? I'm going to not answer that yeah. just yet uh, and for reasons that I'm sure you can understand. All right, now, I'm actually going to go into a completely random free roam and just be like, hello there. What's up? Now, after this one, we're going to do another build. And then, of course, we've got more code rounds coming up after that as well. But, y yeah, Kyle? Yeah? Wow. What? Wow. 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 Oh, my God. Okay. Yep. Knew that was loaded. Knew yep. it. Yep. <laughs> I am not surprised. Um, <laughs> yep. Like, are you? <laughs> not really. <laughs> like, I knew, I knew something like that was coming. I, right? Yo, um, I spawned in this map, and, like, the second I spawned in, someone else spawned literally directly inside my vehicle. Um... Yeah, uh, Drake Williams, so essentially all I'm doing is I'm emulating a mobile device. So, cool stuff says check Discord. Oh, don't worry, I'll be checking Discord again extremely shortly. Now, let me, uh, actually go to my house. Now, my house on this map is not the house I normally go to, but the creator of this map actually, like, literally worked with me to design a house, and I, I don't use it as much as I should. Yo, that setup looks amazing. The trailer's a little, uh, a little, like, not that much detail, but, I mean, that's not, like, a bad thing. Alright, let me see if I can turn in here without completely destroying, like, my truck and everything. Um, but yeah, the, the crashes are just, like, it's just because it's an emulator, you know? Um, we'll crash sometimes when it needs to be updated. I have my Bluestacks set to auto-update, so it immediately, uh, gets updates whenever they become, uh, available. So, why is there a tree growing in my garage? I didn't ask for that. I <laughs> literally never asked for that. TM Customs, what's up, dude? Oh, jeez. Back, 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 back. And... Oh, no, 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 no. Stop it. Bruh. It, bruh, stop it. 
Come on. Back. 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 And that should be... That should be decent enough. And then I'm going to back up next to it. And then I'm going to see what happens when I swap trucks. Where's it going to put me? Oh! Uh, um... Help! <laughs> <laughs> I'm... Well... Oh, wall hack. I got it! I got it! Yo, I can actually put, like, all of my... Let's see, some micro NSX. Uh, my name is Trevor. I build off for trucks and drag cars. That's awesome! My name is Rice, Rice Exclamation Point of the Discord. Heck yeah, dude! Oh, this is great. I can actually get all my trucks side by side in the garage now. And my trailer. That would have only been able to work if, like, I had, um, like, glitched into the wall. So I'm actually really happy that that worked out as well as it did. Blake, look at this, bro. Like, this is definitely very show truck, but, like, I don't hate it. It's actually kind of cool. It's kind of neat. And then was this what was in your... Oh, that was what was in his trailer. Oh, that looks awesome. That looks really good. Ooh, we got another dude coming up from over there by that other house across the way, by that metal building thing. Um, Yeah, every once in a while, ducks will appear on this map, but uh, looks like we have no ducks today. Or at least none right now. Aaron Perkins dropping the... Whoa! Dude, send it, Co. Oh, my God. That's great. Oh, and... Yeah. Yeah. It's because everybody was trying to switch uh, right there in the same area. Let's see. I believe map makers need to update their maps from time to time. Otherwise, trees will grow in random spots. Oh, that's very weird. I have a truck just like your tremor. Oh, that's awesome, bro. Like, that's sick. Now, let's see. It's the chrome. It crashes the... The chrome? What do you mean? Oh, like the chrome wheels? I didn't even, like... I didn't even think about that. That's kind of, like... That's actually kind of different. Um, now, let's see. Um, I want some... Uh, I want some inspiration for a... Whoa. Okay. I'm getting some inspiration for what we could do to the... Um, for what we could do to the to the Chevy, the Duramax. And I think, well, first of all, let me get rid of that uh, code strip. Um, let's see. Boom, there we go. All right. Now, should we do it to this one? Or should we, like, kind of change which truck we're doing it to? Now, I before I do anything else, I do want to get that Ford back out of this trailer. And actually give it a little bit more... A little bit more oomph, a little bit more beans. And when I say a little bit more beans, I mean a little bit more thick. You know what I mean? Uh, when you switch vehicles, it re-registers the decals. So when a bunch of people add them and switch trucks next to each other, it freaks the textures out. And the mobile device graphics can't handle it. That's fair. But you would think almost that, like, when you're running on a PC, you would think that, like... Obviously, I know that it's going through an emulator and all that stuff, but... You would think the processing power of a PC would be able to help account for that, but maybe, I guess maybe not in, in all cases, you know? Um, so I'm gonna ramp the Oh, nope, that's not what I meant to do. Um, I'm gonna ramp this up just a little. There you go. Yeah, there you go. 6.62 and 0.5... Eh, 0.53. Yeah, that's not bad. And then now the front radius, I'm going to bump it up too. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Why, Mikey and Tom? Why? Why would you do this? Wait, let's see. Um, Wait, why'd you tell me out? I was just asking a question. Wait, what question? Um, uh, yeah, I, I see. I, mean, I scrolled back through, and that's the first comment I've seen from that account. It might so be if there was a timeout, a... it wasn't any of the moderators who did it. Well, it might have been someone Unless... on, a, on a different account. Like, that might be a secondary. Yeah. Um, ooh, hoo, 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 hoo. Yo, this is, um... Oh. Well, the thickness factor has gone up, for sure. And not only that, but, like, I also realized we completely forgot to... Wait, hi, DZ. Uh, sorry, I can't watch. It's 2222, and I'm sitting under... What? In a... What? I think that was supposed to be a bridge. Uh, okay. Um, 
Because uh, <laughs> sitting under a badger does not make any sense. <laughs> like... Wait, isn't there a vehicle called a badger, maybe? Wait, I didn't even think about that, but you are... I think you're right. I don't remember what game it was in, but... Was it, like, a GTA vehicle? Uh, maybe? I still haven't... I can't really afford all the GTA vehicles yet. For some reason, I keep losing a lot of in-game money to Pew Pews. I don't know why, but... Basher, uh, yeah, not Badger. Oh, okay. Um, okay. and let's see. Um, hey, buddy, what's the Discord login password? Bruh! Bruh! You don't need a... Bruh! What? No, you you don't need anybody else's login credentials to get into the Discord server. That's... If anybody tells yeah, you uh... you need that, that they are sus and you should cease communication immediately. <laughs> um, yes. And that's all I can really say about that. Now, let me throw a little bit of extra lighting on this truck because we haven't, lit like, we literally haven't touched the lighting at all. Um, I like the light bar, but I feel bad about putting the light bar up there considering the fact that we've already got cab lights. Um, I do want an exhaust because right now it doesn't have one. And, okay, I know a lot of, wait, um, always, aha, wireless, aha, yeah, exactly. Um, let's see. Um, bro, really, TP64? Really? Um, will there ever be a time that you will do a three-hour stream? Uh, Tara, hold on. Most of my streams are three hours. If you go back and look at the, uh, the replays. Mm. Zulgrass, what's up, dude? Drake Williams, are you doing open lobbies? Absolutely. We're just currently in the build stages of this particular truck. Now... I may go ahead and do, I think I'm going to do the large, like, dump pipe exhaust on this one. But, obviously, we'll do, really? Oh, I've gone, I, I, I think I've gone too overload, or too overboard on the decals. Um, I, I really, I think I've gone too overboard on the decals. The game is freaking out on me now. Man, I, yeah. oh, I think, oh, what's up, Jackson G? And also, I think it could partially be due to the fact that I have... 105 trucks. <laughs> you know, what? now I wonder, how many do I have? Takata, what's up, dude? Lower your graphics. I refuse. I do not want to lower Same. my graphics. Lowering my graphics sounds ridiculous. Now, wait, hold on. Um, also, the dude with the really, really long name is... Um, oh, it's Mr. Gamer. Um... Yeah, and he he was spamming a lot in on his other accounts. So yeah, I I figured, I figured that that was a thing, and you know, like I'm, it's one of those things where like we, when we time someone out, especially for spamming, that's not something that it's like. There's a reason we do that, and. The reason is usually because spamming is, like, it, it it takes away from the conversations that people are able to have in the actual stream chat. So, Aiden Everett, what's up? And Florida Fishing, what's good, dude? I'm going to actually go back through the Discord as well. We got DX Joe with a, um, let's see. Oh, it looks like a really nice Silverado 3500 HD. Very nice. And we've also got a third gen. It's actually... Actually, really low to the ground. Also, Car Park and Boss with a massive K3500. I mean, that thing is absolutely huge. Also, a very odd, uh, yet very interesting um, monster Chevy, William Whitaker. And, oh my god. Someone has an entire Among Us fleet. Are you seeing that? Yes, I did. It's... Oh, no, it's Beeb. Of course it's Beeb or Bibbe. I don't even know how you... I'm just going to call you Beeb. I... Bruh. What, what is it with Beeb's obsession with Among Us? It might be... Are you ready for this? Yes. Us. Oh, it's sus, all right. Um, It's very sus. Uh, Let's see. The Outdoors, what's up? Koi, Clark CC2, what's going on? Car Parker Boss, sus. Um, What kind of streets do ghosts haunt? Dead ends. Ooh. 
<laughs> that's a real wow that's a real knee slapper there bud i tell you what <laughs> god that that's bad wireless that is just like and i haven't even heard that one and i've heard a lot of bad jokes trust me i have heard a ton of bad jokes but that that, that, I'm gonna die from cringe. Let's see. Murdered BRZ, do you think the Michelin Man likes Yokohama? N no, probably, be <laughs> probably because I mean, he's I, the Michelin Man. <laughs> I mean, I see what he's saying there. I know, right? Exactly. <laughs> oh, it's great, though. It's freaking wonderful. All right. Now, I think it's time to continue to push public servers soon? Absolutely. The next one we're going to be going into is actually a public server. So it's actually time to visit the dealership and pick up our 105th vehicle. Can I'm you... at 37, so... <laughs> You're at 37? Literally 37 trucks and trailers. Okay, I thought you said 137, and I was about to say, you absolute maniac. Like no, that's that's Forza. I have like forty chargers or something. I mean, I can't blame you for having forty <laughs> chargers, but like, why do you have forty chargers? <laughs> oh, because I can. Dude. <laughs> and I, you know what? I gotta support it. I get it. Um, really, Hanketh? Really, uh, Jacob Lowe? I again, brand wars are kind of eh. I'm not, eh, I'm not going into the brand war aspect of things. I have 170 cars and trailers. Wow, that's a lot. Um, I haven't built one of these classic Chevys, by the way, in a very, very long time. And normally, I would go for the diesel swap and, you know, do the full, like, Duramax build and everything like that. But I actually want to do something a little bit different because... If I go ahead and cut out the hood, I can turn this thing into, actually, I could turn this thing into a crazy street truck. And we haven't done a street truck build for the shop in quite a while. And this actually, I think this truck really freaking deserves it. It deserves a proper street truck build. And not only like just a normal street truck, but like a drag truck. So... My wheel radius is going to go down to like 0 0.8. And the reason it's going to go down to 0 0.8 is because, well, I need all the speed I can get. And I need to remember what it was that I did to um, to prevent the, like, uh, the truck from bouncing all the time. And I really don't remember what it was that I did. I, I, I seriously don't. I, do you remember what that would have been? Because I sure as heck no, I don't. don't. Oh, man. This is going to be so good. This is going to be so good. Oh, I can't wait to put the drag tires on it. I'm about to lower it down. And, oh, man. Once I get this thing set up right. G-Man Plays, what's up, dude? You should put tracks on it. Uh, yes, the official T-Dub. Absolutely. It's freaking amazing. All right. I'm going to put the damping up to, like, uh, let's say 3,400. We'll start there-ish. Um, and then we need to get this thing dropped. So travel, stiffness. I'm going to say I want to keep the like keep at least a decent amount of stiffness. And that's a little too low. There we go. And then we'll bring the rear as close as we can without the truck like sitting on it and then let's see axis width we don't really need to mess with that to be honest because man it's like i mean it's not really a oh i see hold on uh leaf spring there we go go ahead and tuck the mounts up as high as we can and now i gotta go and get the tire set up on it that i need put slicks oh absolutely and let's see um Oh, that would be awesome to do. Uh, Crazy Kid, what's up? Jeremy Shoemaker, welcome back. And let's see, Shadow Assassin, I'm glad you're liking the rig, dude. Build a turbocharged C10 with no hood and no bumper and just drew an intercooler down where the bumper used to be. That's legit. Wait, wait a minute. Can I take the hood off this thing? 
Oh, Maybe? I forgot that I could do that. I forgot that I could do that. Yo, that that looks really good. And actually, I'm going to do, but I'm going to do that. The blower with no surround on it. Oh, that's, that's just clean, dude. That's just, that's just so mean. All right, here we go. So, street tires in the front. And then in the back, we'll do the proper, like, proper slicks. Oh, oh, I can't wait for the first test drive. I cannot wait. I am so pumped for the first test drive. Uh, Larry's Classics with the 199 Super Chat. Offered Outlaws should have fishing. I think, hey, I mean, they've got duck hunting right now. So, fishing wouldn't be, um, it wouldn't be too out of the norm. Uh, let's see. What's up, 615? I see you checking it out there in the chat. I saw that message that you just pulled, by the way. Um, yeah, he's just, I think at this point, he's just spamming or just posting random messages. So, yeah. All right, we're going to go ahead and chrome out the fronts. And then the back ones are going to be, oh my God. I, whoa. Hold on. Yo, I'm, I'm officially blown away by this thing. This is going to be a absolute riot to drive. I haven't put any, any of like, uh, like the, the decals or anything on it yet. I just got to do, I do have to do a little bit of gear tuning because the gear tuning is, well, like, I feel like it's like three quarters of any drag truck. Um, so let's see. So get the launch gears and then my third gear, if I can get the third gear is going to be like, uh, we'll do one five and then fourth one oh and then fifth we'll make that thing pull we'll make it point seven and I also am gonna throw a perfect setup on it I know that it's not gonna be the fastest because it isn't um it isn't diesel and in this game for whatever reason diesel swap is the um is like always gonna be the fastest way to go because it's got the most torque. So I'm gonna actually load this thing into the trailer. And let's see, uh, G-Man Plays, you have a question? What's up? And Jordan and Zero Dead Boy, welcome back, you guys. Thank you for stopping back by. And not in the cars? Wait, what? Uh, you mean like diesel isn't the fastest in the, hmm. I was, I was under the impression that like the diesel engines were always the fastest, like kind of on a no matter what kind of basis, you know? Um, so I mean, I will say my El Camino with a diesel swap is a rocket. It's now, I'm, stupid, I'm not really yeah. a good, I'm not really a good tuner, so maybe I'm just getting lucky with brute force here. I don't know, but yeah, true. It, yeah, which actually, now that I think about it, that's how I drive pretty much everywhere, isn't it? <laughs> I mean, it is. So it's not like it's out of the norm for you. I have to go mow the lawn. See ya. All right, dude. We'll see you when you get back. We will see you when you get back. How you doing today, mate? I'm doing well, Jaden T. Uh, 2003. Mm -hmm. 69 Camaro, uh, the horsepower is more in the gas than in the diesel. I did both. Interesting. Okay. So it's probably just got more top end. Um, Let me set this drop hitch a little bit. Remind me like... not to race you, Prince. <laughs> yeah, right. That's like 14. <laughs> I know better than that. Drop. Oh, man. This this uh, this F-350 pulls well. I mean, I haven't even set up the gears on this thing. It pulls great. Hot five. What's up, dude? Whoa. Now, whoa, God, I launched my trailer in the air on that one. Now, again, remember, we haven't done any, um, like, literally, we haven't done any of the decal work on the C10 yet. So it's very, like, it's very barren. Um, so if you look at it and you're like, why is there, um, like, why is there nothing on it? That's why. If Offered Outlaws added spoilers, hey, if they added all, like, literally, if they added all of the wings that were in uh, No Limit, I think that would actually be kind of cool. I mean, it'd be funny, and you wouldn't have to use them if you didn't like them, but I think it'd be kind of funny for sure. Oh, this thing's fast already. I'm going to tell you, like, right now, it, it, it seems, anyway, like it moves. It looks wonderful, too. I can't wait to throw the decals on it. All right, let's see what it can do. And go. Okay, that's pretty good. 
115 miles an hour by the end. The the end of the main street on um on Twin Rivers Lake. Instantly, Alex is like, I could smoke you in an instant. And I'm like, I'm pretty sure that's what you've been telling me on every stream. Let's see, I just tried to post my truck yard. Um, that broke and Discord said that an error happened and gave me a slow mode timer. What? That's weird. Um, Diesel, do you know if like, if Discord, did you? So if. Well, number one, I got to get rid of that code that just got posted. Guys, yeah. please don't post your own code in the server or in the channel, excuse me. In the chat. Um, yeah, that's the one. <laughs> that's the thing. <laughs> but but yeah, there is a slow mode timer that shows up when you've made a previous post. So, for example, Jamie Miller in the Discord now, who has a really killer C10 from the look of it, he's just posted now and he'll get a little notification in the corner, the like the bottom corner of the uh channel telling him that he can't post for another 10 minutes right so i'm assuming i'm assuming that's what the other user said i missed the name by the way yeah um or and also, i should say what the other user is encountering also uh spiritual snake says i can't join discord um you mean that like the app won't work or um or like it just won't let you in are you getting an error um let's see dude yeah no worries at all zero dead boy no worries at all um let's see Post my uh, C10 to the Discord. Hope you enjoy. Um, Kobe is like, TC, I am calling you out. And I'm like, well, hey, if you get into one of the random lobbies, I am totally down to race you. I'm down to race anybody. Um, let's see. So here's where we... Prince. I'm not going to race Prince. <laughs> well, yeah. It, yeah. I'll race <laughs> Prince. I know I'll get smoked, but I'll race him. Um, let's do a quick little design on this C10. And... I'm going to say, I know that what I'm about to, so I'm, I'm going to do the TC logo first, then I'm going to do TC customs on the side, and then I'm going to do a couple of other things that I think will be um, really nicely suited to the truck itself. So here, we'll do that right there, black it out, and that's good to go. And that, obviously, we can mirror because there's nothing, like, it, it's not like it's going to, you know, flip the text upside down or anything like that. Um, and let's see, boom, and then edit. So let me go ahead and throw the TC logo together. And now that that's good to go, oh, there we go. Now it's perfectly blended. Well, almost perfectly blended with the color, but it doesn't have to be perfect, perfect, but it's close. And that's kind of all that I'm looking for. So let's see. I want it to kind of be just about symmetrical. And that'll be good enough there. So let me duplicate that guy and swing it around. And oh, God. All right. Well, let me put it there real quick. And then let me turn off mirroring. I didn't realize I left mirroring on. Uh, Yep. 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 Okay. Now that's done. All right. So now we got to do TC Customs down the side. And that'll be, that'll be very easy. So... We're just going to do TC Customs, but we'll do it as, as a nice, like, 3D. And I'm thinking it'll be... So, here. Go all the way back. We'll do a chrome gray on the bottom. And then once that chrome gray is all nice and sorted out, then I'll get all the extra, like, all the extra logo stuff out of the way. Bro, really? Hold on. Oh, man. Come on. Duplicate the way I would like you to. You're going you're gonna to crash, aren't you? Prince, that's your sand drag car. And there we go. Wait, I posted my sand drag car? Oh, dear. Um, Wait, let's that's, see. That's something I'd do. <laughs> wait a second. I need to see this. Um, Sand drag. Oh, the sand drag Camaro. That's delightful. Rate mine out of 10. CBMX, that's a definitely at least a proper 8 or a 9. That thing is gorgeous. Loving that, Um, uh, let's see, that second gen as well. Uh, noob, eh. Um, let's, whoa, Jamie Miller has a 6 C10. That's, that's gorgeous. Another Tremor build. Loving that one. Can I join the public lobby? Hey, William Whitaker, hey, if you, if you um, bump into me in any of the public lobbies, I am totally down. Also, what is that? Holes Apple, that is 
a massive, looks like the side profile of a Camaro. It's got gigantic monster suspension underneath it. Parker Grog, I've seen another Camaro that you just posted. And a collection of, um, whoa, what is that? Yo, is that all just playing crazy? Yep, dude, just playing crazy. I'm loving your collection of rigs. And let's see, Broken Toaster. Very nice realistic builds on the second gen and the first gen as well as uh, Joshua. And let's see, whoa. Also, Dirty Bird with the realistic cat eye. Very nice work, y'all. Very nice work, you guys. Y'all are dropping some really, really sick stuff. Okay, so let me get this guy done nice and 3D'd. And wait, is that... Chrome as well. Yes. Okay. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Okay. So that's good there. And now up here, I don't know if I want to do that or yeah, we'll do this. Let me set it up the way I need it. And we'll do supercharged up there. Ooh, that looks great, dude. That looks, that looks awesome. Let me see how that looks as well once it gets 3D'd. And, yeah, that, there it is. Oh, I don't know how much decal work I lost, but I... I just lost a bit of it. Um, wait. If you see Battery Power Pippin, that's me. I can't change my Discord name because I forgot my password. Oof. <laughs> um, you should hey, put a, when that happens. Yeah, I know, right? You should put a taxi decal on the truck, uh... That says, fast rates, only two uh, two people per trip. Oh, did that get rid of every single decal? I am, I am upset. All right. Well, here's what we're going to do. Uh, quick fix for this is literally um, just doing the TC logo. And then I'm just going to send it from there. Uh, I, that's a... That's, that's sadness right there. That's actual freaking sadness. I didn't think I was going to have to worry about it until we got, like, way more complicated on the build of the truck. Uh, clearly, I was quite wrong. And, well, I paid the price for it and lost, like, all of my decal work. So, RIP, and uh, we move on from there. All right, get the logo centered. And, you know, I'm not even going to care that it's not mirrored properly on the other side. Um, wait. Garrett, Garrett Amstutz is... Wait, hold on. Oh, no. Oh, God. Fortnite Battle Pass. Oh, jeez. Okay. Well, um... We'll... Uh, yeah. We'll talk about that some other time. Um, let me grab... I think I'll tow this one with the Tremor. Yeah, this will be good. And... What do you mean no equipped trailers? Oh, I didn't get... Yeah. I didn't... Wow. I thought I unloaded my stuff from the uh, from the camper. I didn't. The camper got entirely unequipped. Yikes. Do you think they will add deer or some other animals for hunting? I, honestly, Jaden T, I really hope that they do because with the, um, with the American Marksman game that they teased in their official Facebook group, I think it wouldn't be too far-fetched to, to see them do that. Um, Zulgraz, um, mm, I see you saying, especially, uh, in all caps that you can't join the Discord, uh, Diesel just put a link out there in the chat. Try that, and if it doesn't work, let us know what issue it's giving you, um, because if you let us know what issue it's giving you, that is gonna be the best way for us to help you. Now, they should add a Tacoma? Oh, yeah. Wait, it's popping off said TC, and then G-Men plays immediately after also said TC. Um, what is exactly going on? Um, is there something going on out there? Um, uh, let's see. I got a clue, honestly. Um, uh, Peyton Francis, can I play? We're about to jump into a completely random server, and oh god, my camera started freaking out. Today, our tow rig is, of course, gonna be the F-350 Tremor. We're gonna jump into a completely, like, open, random lobby, and whoever's in here is in here, so this is gonna be, this is gonna be very, very interesting. Um, then again, then Wireless said, TC, and then G-Man Play said, TC, and I'm like, bruh, let's see, I reckon it'll be good indeed, uh, thank god I have Facebook, lol, um, yeah, we talked about it on the other, uh, on the last Offered Outlaw stream, and I was really intrigued by it, I think there's a lot to be excited for there, I really, really do, what vehicle should I use for a luxury Uber, well, 
Hmm. An F450, LOL. <laughs> oh, Indiana Redneck dropping that $20 super chat. Thank you so much. Hi, DC and everyone. Uh, hope everyone is having a great day. I put another one of my clean builds into the Discord car show. Also, did you see all the stuff I just ordered for my DCX 10.3 JLU? I haven't seen that just yet, but I would absolutely love to check it out. And the next time I'm in the Discord, um, after uh, we rotate out of this lobby, I will definitely, uh, definitely be checking your rigs out. Thank you once again so much, Indiana. And let's see, we need to jump back into a lobby. You didn't even get a chance to look uh, look up close at my at my limited. Oh, I'm definitely down to do that uh, at some point soon. Dougie, what's up? I see you saying hi out there in the chat. Honestly, we should all probably jump on GTA at some point. So you can blow us up? No. No, I, <laughs> no he says. Yeah, okay. All right. I mean, have, I, have I blown up your car? Like, the, la the last time we played GTA, the only, the only car that exploded was mine. Yes, but, well, maybe, but, <laughs> but there were a lot of explosions within very close proximity of me and Charlie, so that makes me a little, uh, I don't know, hesitant is the wrong word, careful, careful is, uh, the word I, uh, I, I, I would use. I actually do have some cool cars I want to show off. Nice! So that, so that's part of it. Oh, yo, look at this. Oh, we got some people chilling out out here. Oh, this is sick. Oh, God. Uh, Rockmaster. Oh, geez. Rockmaster with the dirt bike. Um, someone in here. Really? There's someone in here named TC Customs and then another one in here named TC. Um, don't fall for the imposters. The imposters are sus. And I didn't know this until recently, but apparently there are a lot of imposters in, like, a lot of TC imposters in Offered Outlaws because I get messages on Discord all the time saying, um, things like, hey, uh, do, like, you know, like, hey, do you want to DM me back? I just played with you in Offroad Outlaws. And I was, and I'm like, nine times out of ten, I'm like, you did not just play with me in Offroad Outlaws. Because I was not on Off-Road Outlaws at that present moment in time. Somebody literally sent me a message and said I had th said they had just played a game with me or just had a message with me. And I'm sitting there thinking, and I even wrote him back and said, whoever you were in a game with was not me. Yeah, right? All right, let me get lined up here. Let's see if anybody wants to actually run this thing. They don't always want to run it, but when they do, let's see, uh... Let's see, on the fun, what's up? I see you with that uh, 199 Super Chat out there checking in. Someone impersonated me on the stream once. We've had so many, like, odd, like, impersonations on stream. We had a fake dubs for a while. Remember that? Yeah, there was, like, four times that four dubs got impersonated. Yeah, I just felt bad for the guy, honestly. Now, the guy who showed up in Discord using my username in Discord, that was funny. That, yeah, I... I <laughs> that, that's... You kind of have to wonder, like, do they know what's going to happen? Yeah. All right. Race? I think this is going to be a good test run for the, uh, the good old C10 because I feel like these guys are going to get walked. And... Three, two, one, let's go! Also, Indiana's got a point. There was someone impersonating him, too. Oh, that that's fair. That's fair. I didn't remember that one. Whoa. Also, you may want to check DMs when you get the chance. I got you. I got you. Oh, hold on. I'm trying to make a run back down to the other end. Whoa, okay. This thing works, like, really, really well, and I'm surprised that it's not, um that it's not having any issues with, like, bouncing. Because a lot of the rigs that I've built that are... Really? I go to get back on my trailer. I was about to rotate the session anyway, but I I mean, I guess. Okay. Well, that's a thing. Um, that... Yeah. Yeet. Um, but no, like... The, uh, the, the, the lowered trucks that I normally build, um, they normally have a lot of issues with, um, bouncing. And the... Honestly, like... This truck hasn't had any issues at all. Now, let's see. Diesel? Oh, yeah. Uh, hang on one second. 
Is that for drag? I don't know. Is that for drag racing or something else? I think uh, honestly, I think it would be for drag racing or just sheer speed. Okay. Um. Do you uh do you want that to like not be shown when I make it or do you care? Cause like, I mean. I can make it without showing it, but, like, I don't know. It, it, would it bother you if I showed it? Because I don't mind showing it, but, I mean, I'm down. And, like, what um, what vehicle did you use it on? That's another big uh, thing to ask. Single exhaust or double exhaust? Uh, that's up to you. Kind of depends on what engine is in it. Um, I'm going to unload that thing from the trailer. And now i got to find it. We'll see 10. There it is. Oh, my God. What are you doing? What are you doing? Okay, the game froze on me again. Dude, I I have these, like, miniature scares when it, like, randomly freezes on me. Ooh, I love the wood bed. I completely forgot about the wood bed. Um, God, there's all these different options that I always forget about for this little truck. It's such a great truck, though. Hold on. Uh, let's see. The hood options, not going to worry about it. The exhaust options are what I'm mainly concerned about, but I also want to throw some more modern-looking lights in this thing. Now, let's see. Stacks. Oh, my God. Basically, headers that get turned right back up. Um, right back up out of the engine. Um, let's see. Did, um, did Prince ever say anything about that, by the way? I don't think Honestly, he did. Honestly, no. Okay. Um, I also am going to check back into the Discord, you guys, because there is a... Whoa! BR Fossil, that's awesome. I love how you did kind of like an Overland style uh, conversion using the decal editor. And um, I'm seeing your C10, Dirty Bird. And I'm also seeing apparently a Herbie Beetle that has done a bunch of donuts. That is awesome, Bryant. Um, OO Customs, loving the realistic Chevy and side by side. Double Dually Fox Body is apparently a thing. Also, why did you put like Monster Max on Lowrider wheels? Um, there's a, oh God, is that a, bruh, that freaking, is that, yep, that is exactly what I think it is. Wow. My drag Camaro is my Discord car show today, or just car show car, gotcha. That looks really good, actually. Really, really good. I'm digging it. Um, let's see. Uh, Josh is here. What's up? Loving the realistic Chevys and, uh, your main, like, exo-caged crawler. That thing looks so good. Tara, welcome back. I answered in... Oh, okay. Yeah, um... And if you... Okay. Uh... Let's, let's see. I'm just waiting for it to load. Um... Let's see. Put it on your truck. Don't question it. Uh... Oh, is a general... General quick tune. Pretty universal. Um... Uh, sh show the people. All right. Yeah, no worries there, then. <laughs> I can always do that. I'm gonna I'm gonna throw a box in the back just for uh just for repairs. And yeah, that'll be that'll be there we go, that'll be enough. Um once again on the phone, I see you dropping that 199 super chat saying hi out there. Thank you so much. Also high five saying hi, what's up? It did 120 something on the little drag straight on Twin Rivers Lake. That's really good, Indiana. That's that's super good. I think actually, just for my own like I guess, inquiry. Um, I'm going to throw this gear tune on um, the Tremor before I throw it on anything else because, let's see. So what is it? 2.8 and then 1.7 and then 1.2 and then, let's see, 0.8 and 0.6, which I am already at. Okay, so we've got it on the um, we've got it on the tremor, and now I'm gonna throw it on this little thing, and well, maybe this little thing I'll leave alone right now because this has like a not on a tow rig. Well, it's not just a tow rig. That truck is like kind of more. Oh, what's up, Leroy or Leroy? I guess not Leroy. Leroy. Um, let's see, it's popping off. Um, keep saying uh, TC TC out there in the chat once again. I see you. Uh, if you have a um, like a question or anything that you want me to uh, to help you sort out, please do let me know in um, in the chat. Okay. Um, I will also try it on the C10, but I can say for a um, I can say for a fact that the um, that that tremor isn't just a tow rig. Like I know I pull trailers with it, but it's most definitely not just a tow rig. So let's throw the 2.8 right there, and then second gonna be 
1.7. And then we've got, what is it? 1, 2. And then let's see. 0.8 and 0.6. Yeah, 0.6. Should be pretty fast, actually. I mean, I'm expecting proper, like, speedy speed boy things out of this truck. And before I... Oh, God. I, the, the trailer being back there makes it vibrate a whole bunch, and I don't really know why. Um, before we continue on, though, I want to actually have TC Customs down here on the side of the truck, and I want to do it without the game getting angry at me. And so I'm going to do, like, something similar to what I did last time. There's that. And then duplicate, and then black it out, and then 3D. And boom. And here's the thing. Like, I just need to remember to save on basically every stage of that. Yo, that looks so good, though. It's so shiny. Uh, racing people? Oh, don't worry. We are absolutely about to do it. Let's see. I built a trimmer a couple of weeks ago. I coincidentally made the same color. Very nice. Don't blame me when I can't pull the trailer in second anymore. <laughs> Trust me. It'll be fine. I, I don't need it to heavy haul. It'll be fine. It'll be just fine. All right, let me uh, let me dupe the, uh, duplicate this over to the other side of the truck, and go ahead and spin it around just a tad, and it's about right. Uh, it's not. Mm, nope. Hold on. Hold on. All right, custom text there. Duplicate. Bring it around. I don't know how close in size that's gonna be. Probably not all that close. Uh. Let's see. Almost. Oof. Oof. Hold on. Uh. Okay. Wait, wait, wait. I'm almost there. That's close enough. Good enough. I mean, it's kind of 3D on that side, and it it's... Oh, no. I just realized what I did. I am so dumb. I am so dumb. It all just says custom text. Oh, why did I do this? Oof. Hold on. Now I can... At least it's shiny custom text. But you know what I can do? It... I can just change it. And it's fine. TC Customs. Now, I was so worried about getting the sizing right that I completely forgot to actually make it say TC Customs. Oh my god. Four Wheels and Gaming certified TC moment. It's okay, though, because we got it fixed. It's fine now. It's good. I've never actually done that before. That is a mistake I have never made before. Now, let's see. Yo, TC, what's good? I got a diesel-powered dually CUDA. Oh, that's awesome. Let's see. Uh, can you do a meetup? Oh, absolutely. We're actually about to do another uh, meetup round, and I'm going to go through the Discord again very, very, very soon. Now, before I... Ooh, wait a minute. Yo, I didn't even think about... Oh, wow. Uh, I could do something very, very different with... Ooh. I like that. That gives the uh, the underside of the truck just a little bit of extra, like... I don't know. Just a little bit of an extra, like, zest of something. TC funny moments. Let's see. I built a new diesel drag truck. Heck, yeah. That's awesome. Dark in your front wheel chrome color so it matches the back. I thought about that, but I didn't think that, like... I don't know. I thought it looked a little bit meaner this way, but I don't know. I might run a poll for that a little bit later on in the stream. What's up, Gabby? Thank you for stopping by. All right. Now, let me load this guy. Wait. Repair vehicle. I do have a repair pack, right? Yes. All right. Load this thing into the trailer. I said load this thing into the trailer. Come on, Blue Stacks. Come on. Come on. <laughs> yeah, I get how... I get how you might not like uh, the back and forth colors. Um, there have been a couple of people saying that they like their stream was frozen. Um, and if you're having any issues like that, just refresh your page uh, slash refresh your stream and make sure that you have the highest usable quality selected because that can sometimes cause issues uh, with freezing and things like that. Now, let's jump into a completely open lobby. 
and see what we find. I'm very, uh, I'm always very excited to see what we find in these open lobbies, especially the random ones where there's no code. It's just literally like a random lobby. Um, but I am so down to see what we find. It's going to be actually a genuine blast. Let's see. Hello, TC. I've been watching your videos for years, and this is the first stream I've caught. That's awesome, the Vibin' Man, too. Thanks for stopping back by with us. I really appreciate you tuning into your first stream. Thank you so much. Um, also, TC, what do you think about Excalibur? Uh, I think Excalibur is a freaking monster machine. I think it's an absolute, like, proper beast. Do you have a drift car? Uh, if you mean a drift car in Alfred Outlaws, I'm kind of... What? The second it was going to join, it just crashed. I've never Oof. had the... How did that happen? I bet you... I, mean, I bet you it was people storming that map. I bet you it was. Honestly, probably. Like... That seems more like a multiplayer crash or a multiplayer overload than a uh, than a blue stacks issue. Um, could be wrong, but I that's usually the only time that that happens is like when blue stacks gets so overloaded that it just can't keep up anymore. All right, we're trying that again, and I'm having a really great uh, day, Isaac Freeman. How about you? Let's see. Do one of the F-150 uh, EcoBoost twin turbos. I mean, I don't think it'll really, I guess, let you do that. I mean, I guess you could kind of pull it off if you did a gas twin turbo F-150. But I feel like that's the closest you could get. Um, I'm trying to make a drag Range Rover. Oh, that'd be a very odd yet interesting setup. Y'all are creeping up on that uh, 300 likes mark on the stream, by the way, you guys. Thank you so much. And let's see, um, my Discord car is the Green Nova, gotcha, gotcha, Minimo, what's going on, buddy? And let's see, maybe the game is mad because you aren't looking for gold during the gold rush, that's fair. See, now I made it in, no problem. Alright, random lobby, who we got in here? Hernan, Dirt Dust, Winchman, and Drake Williams, why do I, whoa, whoa. All right. Par pardon me just a minute, Mr. Gamer in the chat. Oh, you keep dear. telling, you keep saying to me, please answer, please answer, please answer. Answer what? <laughs> you're just, you're just repeating, you're just pinging me with no question. You're pinging me saying, please answer. I can't answer if you're not telling me what you want me to answer. <laughs> like, and I've told you this several times in the chat. I've said, what, you know, what do you want me to answer? That is, that is a certified, uh, certified diesel moment right there. Like... I, and, and you know what, though? I get it. Like, it's, it is not possible to answer a question that hasn't been asked, you know? Let's see, how long have you been oh, live that streaming? Is like, killer. What? Fortfan7 in, in the Discord channel. Check out what he did and what he called it. Let's see. Fortfan7? Yep, in the Off-Road Outlaws channel. Let's see. Whoa, whoa, that's amazing. He rebuilt Doomsday. Well, as close as he could get, but still, that's amazing. Oh, God, Wiles, all right. Let's see, I'm doing really well, Garrett. How about you? I just smashed into a guardrail because I was looking at chat when I shouldn't have been, but I'm actually heading back over to where the gas station is, so hopefully we'll be able to meet up with some other rigs and also race the C10 for the first time with this new tune. And Prince... I love how you said this thing wouldn't tow. I'm towing it like 70 miles an hour. I... Maybe this tune is better than you thought. Or maybe this tune is, like, fine for towing when the loads are light. I mean, this trailer is not very heavy at all. Like, the toy hauler with, like, a truck inside of it, it's no big deal. So, like, I mean, I don't know. Maybe you, uh... Maybe you, uh... This, maybe you underestimated this thing's uh, actual capabilities when it came to towing. All right, we got some people chilling out up here. Skirt! Wow, there's only, like, one dude. Uh, let's see. Let me go ahead and pull this thing in here. Well, actually, no. You know what? In order to... Wait, it doesn't weigh anything. The other trailers weigh a lot more. I am aware. Trust me. I put that to the test. Um, yeah, I am going to... I'm just going to say it right now. The goosenecks suck. The goosenecks are so artificially heavy. Um, all right. I am going to put my other vehicle in here because I feel like that way 
I don't know if this is like actually gonna work or not, but I think that putting my trailer and my other truck away from where everybody else is should help at least prevent the crashing. So, don't know if it'll work, but I'm totally down to try. Ow. Wow, I smacked the crap out of that guardrail. All right, this should be a really good launch, though. I want to see what kind of speeds this thing will do by the end of the uh, by the end of the strip. Let's see. I need the map name, please. Uh, the map name is Twin Rivers Lake. Ow. Oh, grand. All right. I'm a bit stuck. Okay, not anymore. I was like, I'm a bit oofed. Hold on. Let's see how it launches purely in rear-wheel drive. All right. All right, what kind of speeds are we hitting by the end of the straight? And... Send it! It's not bad! It's not bad. It's definitely... It feels like it's for a longer stretch than, uh, than this particular street. Because it was a couple miles an hour slower than the truck's old tune, but... I feel like it's kind of the difference between, like, a quarter-mile tune and a, like, you know, eighth-mile tune. Yeah, probably. Yeah, see, like, this thing is way faster top-end-wise than my tune was. My tune just got to the end of the strip a little bit quicker, but, I mean, the mile per hour, I... Yeah, tune for tune, this thing definitely has it on the mile per hour. Oh, God. Oh, God. Stop, stop, stop. Yeah, somebody, somebody, like, that was in the process of joining, just like, you may be running less horsepower. I mean, I don't know how. I've got a fully built gas engine with the perfect tune. Like, I'm literally fully built. I don't know how else I could be running, like, I don't know how I could be running less horsepower than you would be. Unless there's some, like, you know, hack, that, or not even hack, but, like, Easter egg that I don't know about. You know what I mean? Um, what's up, Gabby and William? I see you guys checking it out there in the chat. This is a, um, by the way, a completely, like, random lobby. This is a, this is not a code lobby. So, what that means is that it's basically, like, um, it's basically just open to, ah, uh, yep, and boom, crashed. All right, well, forced rotation, I guess. Um, let's see. One thing I really wish the devs would change is how the gooseneck trailer reacts with curbs and ledges. Uh, when I use it, at least, it gets stuck, and it's super hard to use because of that. I, I agree. Um, and yes, wireless, I saw the, I, I saw you post that the last time. Um, let's see, can you roll some coal, please? Oh, don't you worry, we are absolutely going to be doing that. So, for two years of due date, uh, two days ago, I made a C10 drag show that is red, too. That's awesome! Hmm. Am I almost through? Wow. I have been, like, consuming this smoothie for, like, over two hours now. Let's see, when are we going to see another video on the Tundra? Actually, stay tuned. There's more of that coming really soon. Um, that might be why, actually, Prince. Wait, read my dino run in Discord with a gas motor? Uh, is it... Hold on. Is it... Is it perfect tune, or is it something different? Because I'm... Uh, I'm curious now. Let's see. In front of Outlaw's channel, by the way, I found it. Oh, it, okay. I was looking, I was literally looking at DMs. Hold on. Um, so he made, okay, it, Prince, that's, the Camaro gas engine is going to make way more than the C10 gas engine. That's not, like, even a question. The, um... And yeah, that's that's what he just said. It's oh, not yeah, all okay. gas motors have the same horsepower top end, so that's probably why his car goes faster. Yeah, no, and I, I and get that. I just, does. yeah, I, I thought that he was saying, like, you know, that that was kind of an effect of the, um, you know, of, of something in the tune. And I'm like, no, they have different engines entirely. Um, let's see. Don't you think Offered Outlaws needs semi trucks? I do and I don't. Uh, I don't know if, like, you get what I mean with that? Like, when I say I do while I also don't. Um, by the way, by the way, I am also going to, uh, I'm going to convert something into a TC Customs mud truck. I think it's about time. And not only is it about time that we converted something into a TC Customs mud truck, I think it's about time that we went to the mud in general. Now, we've got our TC Customs second gen, the get on my level second gen. Um, I think 
that if we're going full mud truck on this thing, we need to make a couple of adjustments, including, um, including, can we, all right, I'm looking at the fenders right now. Can we go to a, like, really big single wheel setup? I mean, this looks cool, yes, but I think that going to a, like, a big single wheel would be a lot more applicable to, like, a mud truck. So, we haven't done any mud trucks for the shop in a really long time, and I think that's kind of, like, I think that's actually kind of bad because, well, wait a minute, or we could dually the front as well. Let's not. <laughs> Let's not. That's kind of, like, that's kind of nuts. Now, we are going to have to match the uh, the offset front and rear now. And we will also need to take the dually fenders and remove them. But now that we've done that, that's completely fine. And we just need to fix the offset and stuff like that in the tuning. So, go back into the suspension. And what are we, 0 0.03? Oh, God, yeah. 0 0.03 in the back as well. But now, in order to make it somewhat, like, extra realistic... Uh, wait a minute. Daniel Wood 32 says, uh, my phone is smoking. If your phone uh, is smoking, seek emergency attention immediately. Um, <laughs> let's see. I wish they would put, uh, all the engine options that are in no limit racing in here. Uh, I could make some insane builds with that. Yeah, definitely. Again, Garrett. Seek emergency phone attention immediately because that is not supposed to be happening. Like, not in any way, shape, or form or universe is that supposed to be happening to you. So, yeah, uh, phones are not supposed to emit smoke. Um, base, well, I fell asleep in the stream playing. Nothing gets you. I'm just drained. I get it. I've, you know, like, literally I'll put on my favorite TV show and then, and then I'll fall asleep. Like... I, I don't take offense to that. Like, I feel like if anybody ever, like, takes offense to that, that's, like, that's not even, like, like, what do you expect? Like, sometimes people have, like, really intense days, you know what I mean? Like, whether it's at work or, like, stuff they got going on, and sometimes they just, sometimes they just pass out, you know? All right, what is it, 2.0? And Yeah, there we go. That's it. Now, if I'm trying to build, oh, my God. Oh my god, dude. This is um This is huge. <laughs> this is I mean I'm gonna actually bump the stiffness up to get more um like to get more height out of it because what's up Shane Daniel and uh Devin Cheryl map name please uh the Maverick Stone what's up dude we're actually about to go back into the uh that's un thing um, let's see. I've got a monster slash mud truck. I want to see if you'll recognize it. Oh, yo. Yeah, throw it out there in the chat. Bro, that's a sick Bronco. That's super wide. Like, mega wide. Um, I'm actually looking through a couple of different things right now. If you guys are, are wanting to post any other vehicles in the virtual truck meet, make sure you do so in our Discord server, which the link to that is pinned up at the top of the chat. All right, so that little extra bit of stiffness... Got us the height we needed. And, yo, this thing is, like, this thing is too big. I mean, I don't know if it's possible for it to be actually too big or not. But, I mean, ah, uh, this is, this is too big. I do wonder, though. I'm gonna grab the, I'm gonna grab the Tremor. And then I'm going to somehow on some, like, in some random, like, shenanigans-driven scenario, we're gonna stuff that into the, uh, the TC camping trailer. We're gonna mix things up a bit. And when I say we're gonna mix things up a bit, grab your mud trucks slash mega trucks, because off we go to TC's quick race, and literally all of the hilarity that TC's quick race is. Now, again, for those of you asking for the map name, TC's Quick Race. Yeah, bro, that smoothie is gone. <laughs> it is gone, gone. Um, do you have an egg I can cook on it? Huh? An egg you can cook I think on probably what? he means his phone. Oh, okay. Oh, God. Danny Mika Thomas is... Oh, dear God. That thing is enormous. Double dually front and rear and everything. 
Let's see, Jaden T, 2003. Hold on. Um, whoa. Rate this Holland rig, Hollows Express. That looks really, really good, dude. Like, I love what you're doing with the designs. And that uh, color-matched bus and F450, the bus does wheelies. Oh, I'm sure. Brunkle J, loving that combination of Fords out there as well. Very nice job on both of those builds. All right, let's see. When is the lockdown truck coming in SnowRunner? I'm not... What? I'm not sure. Um, hey, a TZ Customs uh, Monster Cat Eye. That's legit. Um, I don't know what you mean by the lockdown truck. The, that doesn't make... That doesn't ring any bells. Does it ring any bells to you, Diesel? No, but I might just swipe the name if nobody else has. <laughs> right, if nobody's used the name, like, the lockdown, or just... Honestly, I would just say, just call the truck lockdown. I mean, if you were going to name a truck lockdown, what would you... What would be your basis? Honestly, I don't know. Hmm. Like, a few people... A few other modders, we were talking one day about like help, trying to help me figure out a name for the truck and it was like i pulled a name out of my hat and it's and the other fellow said well there goes my thought process for whatever you were using yeah, right. for a naming scheme right and it's like i just go with whatever sounds good mm -hmm. i'm gonna do a quick test run see what kind of speeds i can hold it's kind of oh my god this is actually pretty good it's pretty fast for maximum size tires, too. Come on, stay up there in the RPMs. Dude, I just wheelied through all of that mud. This thing is... Wow, this thing is a riot to drive. Holy crap. We just destroyed that cat eye. We didn't even just outrun it. We destroyed it. I don't know how we did that well, but that was insane. Ow. Wait, hold on. I was just going to say that someone asked earlier if that was Monster Max, and no, that's Steve. Yeah, exactly. What, the second gen or the cat eye? Uh, the second gen. Oh, yeah, no, this is definitely not Monster Max. Um, oh, ow, boinked. Hold on. I've been fully boinked. Wait, wait. But right. yeah, I will, I will say in terms of GTA, by the way, every, everything's perfectly safe, perfectly sane, and perfectly fine, especially when you get Banana, me, Charlie, and Tommy all in the same lobby. Oh, I bet it is, bud. I <laughs> bet it is. I bet it is. Hey, what's up, Ray Garris? I see you checking it out there in the chat. Thank you so much. I just got rammed into by this Danny dude. Um, I'm going to actually run a proper race this time. Danny's just going to do a wheelie. And then, um, and then, uh, Leroy, I think he is from the stream, so let's see. This is gonna be an interesting race. How do we think this is gonna go? Uh, Evan Klein keeps asking for the code. Uh, this lobby doesn't have a code. It's just a completely open lobby, so, um, like, literally, however you get in, you get in. It's on TC's Quick Race. So, I'm gonna actually set up a, hey, Maverick TC, what's up? Three, two, one, send it! Oh, come on. Oh, no. He's hit me. Oh, God. I'm going to regain this. I'll see ya. Go, 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 go. I need a little bit less on that rebound. I, I feel like my rebound is kind of yeeting me. Oh, oh, no. I, well, I crossed the line upside down. But let's see. Nobody ever gets hit with an orbital cannon. What? Why? I don't know what he's talking about. I mean, it's bananas, so I assume that, like, whatever he's talking about is gonna make sense in some way. Um, wait. DC, it still has a code I just checked. Hold on. No, dude, let me get out of the truck. There's no... Normally, there would be a code down here in the bottom... Uh, the bottom left-hand corner, there would be a code, and there isn't one right now. So, wow. Um, by the way, whoever put whoever put ducks on this map, I love it. Like, Rhett, what's up? You don't want to mud race me. Do I not? Do I not? I take that as a challenge. I'll race you. I'll lose, but I'll race you. <laughs> there we go. We got, we got Mr. Gamer into the server. I don't know what channel he was in, but he's now 
he's now in the server proper. Nice. Also, nice try. Nice, nice try, Toby Gerd. I saw that. Um. Hold on one second. I'm. I'm deleting that uh, from the Offered Outlaws channel because someone posted a sus file. Um. That was weird. It was just a blank file that was like 1.6 megabytes. Um, if that was a photo, please. Yeah, that, yeah please. that's one thing I have noticed. A lot of people, and actually that was Mr. Gamer. <laughs> oh, <laughs> but, no. Okay. I mean, if you could please post it as a real photo, that'd be awesome. Um, yeah. Just, just for everybody, just for like the safety of the server, we have to make sure that the photo format is in like a JPEG something like that the h-e-i-c or h-e-1-c file or whatever that was yeah that just loaded in that one we take those out because it's like we don't know what they are you know yeah and that's not so. to say that you're that i'm not saying like you're trying to post anything sketch i'm not trying to like accuse anybody of anything i'm just saying like for blank files that don't show up we usually pull those out um let's see parker eves what's up uh, eves i guess yeah Nana Nets said Super Chat, thank you so much. Bike Life, what's your join code? I don't have one right now because obviously it's uh, it's a uh, like just literally like a random lobby, but um, wireless AO Prius in off road outlaws, that'd be hilarious. That way Diesel could run it over. Um, let's yes. see. My tr a truck is tall enough to have a piece of the roof above the deepest water. That's brilliant. Also, y'all are closing in on that 300 likes mark on the stream. Thank you so much. Can you make more builds, please? Oh, don't worry. We've got many more builds coming very, very soon. All right, so this was actually a really awesome lobby round. So I'm going to go back to the yard, and we're going to work on a couple of things. And I think we should mud race um, uh, Prince. I really think we should. Yep, I'm... You're on your own. I'm not doing it. <laughs> yeah? Nope, I, I, I know better. Yeah, well, uh, I see... I'm doing it for the experience. I know that I might lose. I know that I probably will lose, but I'm okay. I'm okay with that. I'm okay with it. You probably shouldn't. Yeah, well, um, how about a friendly race? This is not any kind of call out, bud. This is just like, I just want to see what your, tr I'm more than anything. I just want to see how fast your trucks actually are because I know they're going to be faster than mine. Um, I expect to be able to blink and just see Prince at the other end of the finish line. Yeah, basically. Um, I need to dial in a couple of things with the damping because after that last race, I am not so sure that they, uh, or that my truck is set up exactly the way it should be. Let's see. Oh, God. Oh, no. Okay, it freaked out. Hold on. I'm gonna actually lower the stimness a little bit. Back down to, like, 18k. Uh, because I have a feeling that... I have a feeling that that's kind of preventing uh, preventing me from being able to take advantage of, like, uh, the range of damping. So, oh, y'all just blew through that 300 likes mark on the stream. Thank you so much. Oh, you were, Zach Thomas? Oh, that's awesome. I don't use air control, LOL, just suspension tuning, so I have to drive careful. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Okay. Yeah, this seems to absorb pretty well. I need to give it a quick run. No, I didn't mean to load it. Uh, well, dang it. Okay. Um, let's see. Oh, and did you hear they're adding the G82 M4 to FH5? I didn't hear that, but that's uh, that, that. I don't know where you heard that, but hey, if that's if that's legit, I am totally down for that. Like, I am. I feel like I'm in that weird group of people that actually really likes the G80 or G80 slash G82. Like, a lot of people are like, "Oh, it's the big sniff or whatever with the new grill." I like the new grill. Only on the M cars, though. Not on the standard cars. I think on the standard cars, they look awkward. But they look really good on the M cars. All right, Prince. I Friendly race. Let's do this. I'm down. Yeah, he Let's... needs about two minutes, he said. Two minutes? Okay. Well, I'm going to go ahead and get a couple of practice hits in. Also, JK11, digging that massive cat eye you posted out there in the Discord. Thank you so much. Um, Let's see... Mike, what's up with that, what is it, a blown first gen and then a F-350? Indiana, loving that square body, dude. That square body looks so good. And I've got to give, um, let's see, Dirty Bird, mad props for the suspension travel on that S-10. That looks like a proper, proper like, trophy truck, uh, like, adventure right there. 
All right, so I'm going to actually send Prince a quick invite. And uh, it is... Well, that's perfect timing. He says he's ready. Oh, delightful. I was going to say, it's open for him to, like, to jump in when he's ready. But this is going to be quite a race. Uh, Lowrider El Camino? Interesting. I wasn't expecting that. It's legit, and it's my reason for quitting FH5. That and the general... Oh, God. Um, Wait. It... Do you... Di wait, hold on. Is it for the reason, like, depending on the, uh, the popul... Like, the, like, what else you were saying? Or is it depending on the fact that they just added the G82 M4? Uh, do you dislike it that much? Jeez. Can you see this chat? Absolutely I can, Jerry. And what's up, Rylan? Um, but no, so this lobby at the moment, this is a private race between me and Prince. And I, I think it's gonna be a fun one. Um, oh, oh god. Oh, that's a, that's a skinny tire, boy. <laughs> that's a, well, hold on. Let me, uh, unyoink my, uh, my truck real quick. Get everything set up. I just saw how fast that thing approached. Yeah, um, I'm, I'm terrified. <laughs> <laughs> I will quite lose. Um, <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> I yeah. Well, Diesel, on a scale of one to ten, how um, how had am I? <laughs> uh yeah, you're just you're done. <laughs> All right. Well, three, two, one. Let's go. Oh. Oh God. Go 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 go. Ooh! Oh, he's back there still. I don't like that rebound I'm getting. I want to be able to dial out that rebound, but I'm, I'm getting it. Oh, it's going to be close. That was... I, I'm very surprised I was able to, <laughs> to do that. He probably had, like, an issue with the truck, honestly. Like, that was actually really fun, though. That was a really fun race. Holy crap. That was sick. That was sick. That was so fun. Oh my god. I need to get a couple of photos of these trucks. Like, let's see. I want to I wanna go ahead and, like, get a couple of photos of these trucks, like, up here on the, uh, on the top of the muddy hill. Well, maybe not up there. Uh, oh, did he just? Yeah, oh, Prince, there he is. Prince said he clipped the wall. Oh, he did? Yeah, I figured. I figured. Hold on. There's a couple of photos right in front of the, like, in front of the mud. Ram for the win, right? Truck full sender, what's up? All right, let me let him get close to me here. I want to get a photo. This is going to look so good. Dude, this is going to look so good. All right. All right, let me side shift over here. Dude. All right, distance, back it off a little bit so I can see what I'm doing. And, yeah, leave those lights on. Um, Wait, hold on. I'm going to turn my lights also on. Also... No brand wars, guys. They oh, get real, they get pretty tiring to moderate. Let's put it that way. Yeah, brand wars are kind of one of those things that are like it's an oof for multiple reasons. One because brand wars are just an oof in general. Um, oh, speed freak. Oh god. But no, like the the thing about brand wars and them being a big oof is mainly because like all they do is they kind of they they bring out the, like, probably one of the worst sides of, like, you know, of how people will be in a chat, you know what I mean? And, like, I, oh god, oh, I just made a mistake. I just accidentally got out of the truck, and I didn't have the bar on the bottom, which means, yep, <laughs> oh, well, that just filled up in an instant. Well, so Oops. much for Banana getting a run. Banana could get a run a little bit later. I'll definitely pull it back in for another one. So basically, it's the ultimate reason, not the only reason, if that makes any sense. Gotcha, 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 gotcha. I don't really judge any of the I don't even know CDH. what the car that, right? you guys are talking about is. <laughs> huh? I don't even know what the car you guys are talking about is. The BMW Big Sniff. <laughs> I The only thing I know about that is BMW. I have no idea what the nickname is supposed to be. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> Some, okay, uh, Ashton, uh, Unesky Games, Thomas Brown. Someone in the chat 
help describe to Diesel what the G80 uh, M4 is and why it's called the BMW Big Sniff. Um, <laughs> it's the best thing ever. Now, Shady Customs, uh, he brought a... He brought a tiny tire AMG 6x6. So... I mean, I kind of... I kind of know that he's gonna probably win. Um, but, like, I'm ready to run him. If they're ready to run him. And let's see... It's in reference to the grill diesel BMW. What? Let's see. Just Google pig nose BMW M4. <laughs> oh, God. All right. What? Really? Angie. Re Angie. Angie. Really? Dude. Dude. Um. Dude. Really? Right here? Okay. Hold on. Back up. Hold on. I'm about, I'm about to chat. Um. Please park else really. where xd um xd to mean i'm not mad but like <laughs> there we go block collisions there we go that's fine all right i say xd with it because i'm not mad i'm just like i can't race like that you know what i mean um all right and we're good all right spool it up three Two, one, go! Send it! Woo -hoo 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 -hoo. Oh man! Oh dude! Man, this is like me and Prince are getting after. No, Shady, no! Ooh. <laughs> And come on! Oh, dude, Prince and I were so close across the line, and then Shady smashed into me. Oh, God. Oh, man. G80 M4 description, grills are way too big, and it's just ugly. Well, you know, I mean, I... <laughs> oh, man. I don't know if I would call I mean, it, we, like... Can I... we take a minute to appreciate that Prince's big tire mud truck almost beat a small tire cyber truck? You mean, uh, well, the 6x6? That's the thing. Yeah. It's a, or it is a, thing. it is a big tire F450 dually. And it's not only is it like big tire in general, it's tall tire. It's like max height. Well, almost max height. Um, and those trucks are normally not fast. It's probably, oh, how, how I did that. I have no idea. Well, that round was amazing. That was absolutely delightful. Um, we're definitely going to do a quick rotation and get some more people in on this. But that was amazing to race, um, like, to race Prince and then get to race uh, these other guys that hopped in. Now we're going to do a quick rotation. Also, a lot of people are, are asking, like, code, 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 code. This is my slow one. I DM'd my fast mud truck but can't bring it out. I see. Um, wait. Uh... Uh, oh God. Um, Megs, welcome back. Uh, let's see. So a lot of you were like, yeah, code, 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 code. Hold on. Let me see what he DM'd me because, um, I need to see like, hold on. Uh, it, uh, Prince, I don't see anything. I checked. Yeah, I just checked. I don't see anything at the moment. Just think of your typical BMW 4 Series, then flip the grill on its side and stretch it about 100 feet. Yeah, uh, tell you what, I'll make it stream friendly and we can run it back. All right, we'll do that a little bit later, uh, a little bit later on. And then, um, for now, I'm gonna actually get a couple of rigs together, um, that people can race against. And what we'll do this time is, I think, oh, I do want to put a, well, I'm not gonna think about that. Uh, I'm not gonna think about trying to put that on the, uh, on the, the F350. I was gonna put, like, a fuel cap on the F350, but... I was like, eh, I'm not going to worry about it. It's it's a lot of craziness, you know? Yeah, it's got a fuel cell. How about that? Yeah, there you go. Um, and I just don't want to crash the game again. And fortunately, TC uh, uh, TC's Quick Race is an extremely uh, stable map, and it, like, never crashes. So I, I know, I know. Uh, <laughs> there's a lot of people that are probably like, I swear if you jinx that. <laughs> um but here, you know what? Um, you know what? I'm going to put the Ram back in the trailer because I love how it just yeets uh, out of the trailer. Hold on. Look at my truck next to the RZR. Um, wait, hold on. 
Bryant, loving the flex on that Chevy. And let's see. Um, oh, that's you. Uh, my truck next to my RZR. I've been working on this for over a year. Very nice, dude. Very, very nice, like, matchup, too. Uh, let's see. Uh, we got T-Boy with the lifted charger. It's not quite monster, but it's definitely lifted. Just playing crazy with the massive amount of donuts. What's up? That thing looks sick. Um, let's see. I'll have to pass in the uh, mud square body and or do a pass in the mud square body and pose it later. Heck yeah, dude. That would be awesome. What's the next truck meet? Uh, well, to be put quite honestly, it is now. Um, so as we load back into the game, we're going to go back into a, uh, let's see, it's going to be a code-driven lobby. We're going to go back into TC's Quick Race, loading it back up, and it is going to be wild in every possible way. Now, let's see, is the code in the Discord? Uh, the code is like right here. Well, not yet, but it will be right here. Literally right oh. here on the stream. What's up? Also, Prince said that the F450 you just raised him in. That's uh -huh. for people who like to put a winch on your truck randomly, and he can just drag him around with it. <laughs> I love it. I love that so much. I love that so freaking much. Let's see. <laughs> what? I just think that's cool. Oh, it's great. I mean, that's kind of like the trucks you build in SnowRunner. <laughs> yeah. That is if, well... <laughs> That is if, if someone had working physics like that, we should try that in Beam when I eventually get the C50 over there. Oh, dude, it would be gnarly. All right, you guys. I'm going to yoink the truck out of the trailer. And then now uh, we're going to make sure to repair it. And then now we're going to hop out of it and reveal the code for those of you that are paying attention in 3, 2, 1. Gotcha. I didn't hop out of the truck, but I'm going to now. Now you can see the code. It's always funny, like, to find birds on this map because it's, A, it's such a small map, so it's super easy to find the birds when they do appear. Aha! Like that one. But it's too long range for the shoddy, I think. Yeah. Oh, my God. Oh, I got him. Holy crap. He's way out there, but I got him. Yo, uh, Shane is showing up. Wait a minute. Was Shane just... Was Shane in an earlier one? I don't remember. Um, let's see. Rut Dust, Trailmaster, Brandon Clark. Sub to DC. Oh my god, this dude's got an exo cage and freaking lowrider wheels. I don't know why, but okie dokie then. I do dig the like the TC logo with the slightly altered font. It looks like it was like spray painted on there. It's kind of neat. Um Wait, two blur Oh, the code? I mean. Uh, I would recommend um, a lot of people. A lot of people are saying either um, I can't see the code or the code is blurry. You have to um, dial up your quality to uh, like either 720p or 1080p, and that should allow you to be able to see the code. Yo, Shane, that thing is nuts! All right, let me get in the um, second gen mud machine, and I'm gonna lock everything and get over to the racetrack. I have found out, by the way, that the manual gearbox is literally like, it is literally the way you blaze through these. I mean, it's, I would challenge anybody to find a, um, to find an automatic tune that was like, not necessarily faster than my manual tune, but like you take like a perfect automatic tune and a perfect manual tune and with the right driver, like, I, I would think that, like, it, it'd be a hard one to, to go uh, to go up against. That Mud Cummins ain't no joke, though. Don't sleep on it. You know, I mean, I don't think the tune is quite where I want it yet, but it's pretty dang quick. All right, y'all. We ready for a good run? It's going to be sick. All right. And three, two, one. Send it. All right, as long as I keep it in third for most of this fourth and then oh there's the duck i took down um don't worry about that shift up to fourth for the launch third when you get back into the mud and then fourth again to hook the dirt a little bit halfway through there go back to third to bring the wheel speed where you want it tap the wall and wheelie across the line that was that was one heck of a run 
Let's see, Brandon Clark with his power wagon coming in pretty dang close, though. Loving the red, like, with the frame underneath. That was really good. That was a proper run. Um, wait, the cyber wing I have is actually quite... Okay, cyber stuff does not count. Cyber Exactly. Stuff, like, because <laughs> it's... It's got a bajillion torque, and it's... It's not... Oh, I... I... I'm slightly triggered by it because it's just like it kind of takes the competition aspect out of it like if we were trying to build like if the only objective was just fastest vehicle in the game we would all just have cyber trucks and they would all have the same tune you know pretty much but I think there's a lot more to discover based on you know, the tunes that we already have here in the, well, not the tunes, but like the trucks that we have, um, the trucks that we have, I think, you know, we haven't yet found the perfect tune for like each map, but let's see. Um, a bajillion is not a number. And yes, uh, Rose, I, I get that it's not a number. I just, I use it to highlight a point. Uh, let's see the six by six exactly. with the right driver is faster. I agree. The 6x6 is a monster. Um, I have a tiny tire 6x6. It's my fastest thing here, but it's not always my choice to use. All right. Three, two, one. Send it. All right. Leave it in third. Holy moly. Shane is ripping. Oh, well, he was. Oh no! I tagged the wall! I got turned around! Yeah, I got turned around and tagged the wall. I crashed. Man, if I hadn't crashed, Shane would not have taken me like that. But dang. Alright. Shane, I want to do over. I, I, I want to do over. I want to do over. That, nope. I am, uh-uh. I'm not accepting that. I am not accepting that. Nope. How do I successfully get into your server, TC? Uh, do you mean, like... The, uh, the Discord server or the server that we're playing the game in right now? Uh, General Pop and Lock. Because once you let us know that, then it'll be, um, it'll be a lot more, uh, uh, or sorry, a lot less tricky to figure out. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> game server? Um, I am Spooter Truck. Let's see. Mud Trucks, guys, you don't want me to bring the Camaro out. I... I don't want him to bring the Camaro out. Uh, I is Spooter Truck. Hold on. There we go. I'm good. There we go. What the heck, TC? Yeah, it's fine. Don't worry about it. But here's the thing. If I hadn't have tagged the wall, I would have beat the dude in the muscle car. Like, that's, that's how crazy... That's how crazy this is. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's nuts. That's an interesting parking choice. So that happened. Yeah, I always try to have, like, wacky little scenarios like that happen. Um, I don't know who Tony is, but he brought a third gen with a hood stack. All right. Last race for this lobby. And spooling. And three, two, one, go. Sendage. Bro, rode that wheelie out. All right. Oh, no. Foggin'. There we go. Got a good run at that. Come on. Go, 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 go. Up to fourth. Grabbing at the ground. Back to third in the mud section. And jumping it across the line. That was probably the closest to, like, any of the perfect runs that I've had in a minute. So, yeah, I'm good with that one. That one was, that one was fast. I'm, I'm comfy with that. I think once I, uh, wait. Fairbro Tuska wasn't paying attention to, uh, wait. But, hold on. What did he say? I think he's wanting a can Discord you, code. Oh, a, can you do a Discord code? Um, we're getting cl really close to the end of the stream at the moment. But, um, on the next stream, I do want to put together another system as to how, um, we handle lobbies because for the longest time, man, I love how this, uh, this power wagon looks. Um, 
Mad props, Brandon. You did a great job. Like, you really did. I love the suspension. I love the tire size. I love the wheel choice. It just looks like a really tastefully done mud truck. I really, really like it. Now, let's see. Larry's, what's up? With the one that I had super chat. Hey, I'm back. Um... Can I go in the next one? Yeah, I mean, hey, if you make it in on the code. Um, but no, so, finally added into a session. Heck, yeah, trucking with gearheads. And let's see, whoa. Um, in this context, Prince, um, the El Camino, I, I'll i allow it, but, like, it's a truck <laughs> with the, it's a truck with the speed of a car, pretty much, in the context of this game. Um, let's see. I was in the Grand Muscle Car. I remember your name, uh, Shane. Let's see, my phone's about to die, so I think I'll be off. See ya. All right, thank you so much, Rose. Have a great night. And look at my truck in tune. Uh, hold on. I do need to check the Discord again real quick. Presenting NOS Sniper 2.0. Darkhorns, that is a proper build combo. Look at that. Let's see. Um, digging the trailer, by the way. Oh, is that uh, Daddy Dan? Um, digging the Chevy, by the way. Uh, your tune is running, what, like 685 horsepower? That ain't bad. That ain't bad at all. That ain't bad at all whatsoever. Um, nice realistic, oh, is that Isuzu Ombre? That is, that is a very, like, that is not something you see replicated a lot in, um, in Alfred Outlaws. I was in the America K1500, very nice. Wyatt H, I'm loving that TRX. Your TRX looks awesome. And again, Larry's with the, uh, ooh, realistic, kind of rusty, um, kind of junkyard rebuild style, uh, K3500. Very, very nice, very nice. All right, I think for this, um... For this next round here, I think we're going to pull out something that is, uh, <laughs> that is a little bit of a, uh, yeet monster, shall we say. Where is the Yeetachu 6x6? That is going to be the, uh, the, the yeet machine of choice. Now, obviously, I'm going to be bringing along the, well, that, that went, well, crashed while I was trying to find the Yeetachu 6x6. Um, but we're gonna, we're gonna use the Yeetachu to pull the, um, the Cummins mud truck, and so we'll have both a somewhat realism-ish, uh, mud truck, and then, um, we'll also have a, you know, no regard for realism at all, like, yeet destruction machine, um, but that also all depends on whether or not it'll actually let us into the garage to get it, so let me in, please. And thank you. Come on, load. All right, I'm going to have to scroll really fast and hope the game doesn't crash. Let's see. Oh, geez. Oh, geez. Ah, there it is. Move it out. Okay, cool. It didn't crash. I love it. And the second gen is, is still in the trailer. Oh, no, I've got drags on this thing. Oh, I'm really glad that I realized I had drag slicks on it before I took it into the mud map. Oh, my God. Uh, Tara, I stream every Looking Monday, fun. Wednesday, and Friday. What were you saying, Diesel? That would have been fun. Oh, it would have been a thing. Getting the mud with the slicks. Yeah. Um. Uh, let's let's not and say we did. Um. There we go. Those are the tires. That was need. actually... That was a good idea, James Craven. I like how you did that. Wait, where? Oh, in the server? Yep. Oh, with the... um. That's actually really cool. Dude put a beach ball in the bed. But, like, the way he did it, it actually makes it look like it's actually sitting in there. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. I am... I don't know, dude. I'm gonna run the blue Dodge first. And then, let's see. All right, Bike Life. I see you saying bye out there in the chat. You posted bye, like, four times. Um, You should make a Yeetster truck. Oh, don't worry. We have many Yeet machines. Um, let's see, Kayla Harold, what's up? And, uh, uh, let's see, PUBG M Faith, finally I'm in his stream. Thank you so much for stopping by. We genuinely appreciate you. All right, we got to set the drop hitch. What level's this out? Like, uh, 18? Yeah, all right. Look at how this is with a trailer. Um, holy crap, guys. Wait a minute. I've never tried to run this this thing down the uh down the strip or down the mud race track with a trailer and if it's as like silly as i think it is it's gonna be even faster than the blue dodge with a trailer behind it so uh i don't know three two one uh let's give it a try 
Oh my god, I can't even keep it going in a straight line. Holy... Oh my god. Um... Diesel, this maintains like 65 miles an hour in the mud with a trailer. Yep. Those <laughs> things are cheat codes. They are! Oh, I've never done that! Whoa! Okay, um... Well, real quick then, I am going to exit the truck and reveal the lobby code. And now that I've revealed the lobby code, I am sure that I will see a uh, an influx. Let's see. All right. Wait, I think Shady Customs was in here before. Pretty sure. Um, can we confirm or deny that? Was Shady Customs in here before? Oh, boy. Uh, honestly, I can't recall. The name sounds familiar, though. Well, I know he's been out there in the chat, and I want to make sure he gets a chance to play if he hasn't been in here. Like, But, like, if I'm making a mistake and he has been in here before, I, I do want to make sure that somebody else gets the chance to play as well. Um, so let's see. Oh, God. Oh, God. There's so many trucks over here. Wait a second. Oh. J JB. You were in here before. I remember that. I remember that car. We have a, a, a one lobby per person uh, rule to, just to try to make it... Um, to try to make it a lot more, um, a lot more, uh, like, simple for people that haven't played yet. So, JB Customs, Zach, um, I would really appreciate it if you would rotate out and let somebody else have that spot. Because I recognize your, your truck and I would, um, uh, would appreciate it if you would allow somebody else to have that spot that hasn't had it before. Um, TC, why can I, oh, thank you so much. Uh, TC, why can I not join PC players? You can join. Um, we're not playing the game, like, on PC as in a different system. Any system can join, like iOS, Android. We're technically playing on Android because we're using an Android emulator. Um, and also, I want to say, oh, he did, he rotated out as well. Wow, actually, a lot of people rotated out. Okay, so I'm going to race the Dodge Mud Truck first. And then, after I race the Dodge Mud Truck, we're gonna race the Yeetachu. And the Yeetachu is just, it's well into silly territory. It's beyond anything that would ever be realistic. But I think that's part of the reason why we love it, you know? Um, yeah. Let's see, it's either I'm slow or it's because my nap type is strict. Uh, I would bet that, like, internet connection speed probably has more to do with it than your NAT type, uh, for Offered Outlaws, personally. Um, NAT type doesn't really seem to be that big of an issue in Offered Outlaws. I feel like if it was, Diesel probably would have had an issue, because his likes to change on him from time to time. Um. Yeah. But let's see. Keegan and I-5, what's up? Alright, y'all. It's gonna be a fun round. Alright. Get this thing spooling up. And three, two, one, go! Once you start to, like, really memorize your shift points on this map, it, like, actually becomes, like, moderately second nature. It's pretty nuts. Come on, send it. Back down to third, and... Oh, pulling a wheelie. Trying to keep it going somewhat, like, directly forward. And across the line. Well, the second gen decimated that race. Um, absolutely, absolutely decimated. Wow. Welcome back, Little Diesel X. I see you checking in back with us. All right. Now it's time for the AMG 6x6 Yeetachu. And, you know, I, when I bring that thing out, I start feeling bad for people. Is that bad? Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> You're right. Oop. Well, that was some kind of truck gymnastics. Okay. All right. Let me switch. All right. We're swapping. I'm... I am not ready for this. Like, literally every time I drive this thing, I am not ready for how insanely fast it is. Like, I back up and then I floor it and it immediately does a wheelie. And it holds that wheelie. So it's like, boom, and it just stays there, dude, like, every single freaking time. Let's see. Oh, don't worry. I'm gonna, um, Game Boss, I saw your, uh, your, your Range Rover, and I actually, I really liked what you're going for with it. Um, and I'll be able to check back in on the Discord server again in a moment as well. All right. Well, I'm gonna give these guys a head start. 
because I feel like that's the only fair way to do this when I'm running an AMG 6x6. Let's see. Maybe it's because my internet is more doo-doo than a, than a pink Apache and it's squatted. <laughs> Yike. Yeah, that's pretty <laughs> bad. Um, let's see. Oh, that's a very different kind of build. It's like big axles but low and wide on the Ford. Very interesting uh, choice there from Cowboy. All right. Oh, no. There's a 55 in here. I'm, I'm terrified. There's a 55. All right. Well, three, two, one, go. Boink. Oh, this thing flies. So trigger moment. That's a 57. Oh. Okay, never mind. <laughs> <laughs> this is so nuts. Like, all I have to do is literally hit the throttle. And I did a flip in the middle of the race and still won by a large margin. <laughs> yeah, this thing is unfair. It's actually yeah, 57. Yep, that, yep, I'm sorry. Yep, I'm very sorry. <laughs> Yeah, this is, this is kind of insane. Yo, Raid plays with the flip right at the line. That's so sick. Holy crap. Well, what a freaking run there, dude. What an absolutely incredible run. Hood off-road, Hadim, high five, and Nelson, what's up, y'all? But no, like that, what a run to finish her off with. Like, like to finish it off, to finish the stream off, that was that was freaking great. All right. Massive thanks, though, to each and every one of you guys for hanging out with us on the stream today. Whether you were watching, chatting, super chatting, or if you were one of our moderators, um, massive thanks once again to absolutely every single one of you guys. Y'all are literally a, like, you guys play such a massive massive role in the stream, the channel, and of course, everything else that we do here on this platform. And I just always, always want to say massive, massive thanks to you guys. Cause you know, we, we wouldn't be able to do all of this without you guys. And like, this is, this is really like, it's always incredible. I always love just getting on stream and hanging out with y'all. It's always so much fun, but hope y'all have a wonderful night and I will see y'all next time. Peace out y'all.